We're live. <laughs> Hello everyone and thanks for hanging out with me. Hope the microphone works. It's live stream winter range test. Yay. <laughs> ah, that was water coming down here. It's weird. Um Yes. Just seeing that. Yeah, it's all fine here. The right account. Zero people here. What's going on? <laughs> one! There's one person! Oh my god! <laughs> it's so early on a Saturday, it's cold. Now it's it's two degrees. I thought it was minus one and a half. Got a bit warmer. Good morning from Romania. Ooh. How is everyone? Photo storm is here. Yay! <laughs> Yeah, good morning everyone. It's winter range test time. I'm charging at Ionity. I'm at 88%, still charged to 100%. Well, it's, the car says it takes 30 minutes because it's charging with under 20 kilowatt. Party time! So all of Romania is here. And first test is at 90 kilometers an hour. And then later we do the same thing at 130. We do the same thing as in the summer, but I want to be comfortable, so I have to heat on and drive to 55% and then come back here and then we'll see. I expect less than 300 kilometers. <laughs> they know each other, it's even more fun. <laughs> it's Romania that's small, you know each other. <laughs> Where's my calculator? Yes. What is 450 minus 35 percent? 292 kilometers. That's what I, ex I, I expect. 290 kilometer is my expectation. I'm at 89 percent. I don't know if I go to full 100. Maybe I go to 98 or something. All depends how long it will take. I don't want to wait two hours. How is the view from the outside? Hello Inigo, how are you? Everything cool? It looks a bit crooked, eh? It can be crooked. Wit ID3, white. <laughs> Everything is okay, that's good. How's your family? Hope you're okay. Yes, our our little town of Posa here now is 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 the Corona hotspot of Germany. So the district. That's nice. Oh, gotta put this, put it in here. Yeah, the stupid thing always comes off. Yeah, I'm still charging, and it still the car says 25 minutes to charge, to 100%. And this is the first time uh, that in my area it's cold. So tonight was minus three degrees. It was colder before, but just for a bit and, and not. Bonjour, ooh, someone from France. That's nice. Hi from Australia. A little like if we were electric car. <laughs> VV. <laughs> Back. Uh, uh, hello to Australia. Hope you're doing fine. You must have. Had, have nicer weather than we have. It was cold this morning. The car, uh, I did the preheating test in the back was minus four, and in the front, the, the, the it was an inside temperature. It didn't even show anymore. It was that cold. It is snowing a little bit here. No snow, not, but it was cold. It's cold tomorrow too. That's okay. We'll survive. Yeah, you can hear me. Sound works here with the microphone. I hope so. I am not getting more than 300 kilometers with a full charge on my ID3, 4 degrees. Yes, that's okay. I have 240. <laughs> I get less because I drive, I don't want to drive in, in eco and drive slow. I love driving it. That's normal. It's not the most efficient car. Always said it. <laughs> I'm still okay with it. I'm 90% now. And the heat, if you don't have a heat pump, takes two to three kilowatt, even though if you're just maintaining maintaining the heat. It's just that's just how it is. 
So at 90%, I get 245 kilometers. It means at 100, it's 25 more. So 270. That's what I get. And, and like I said, I'm okay with it. This was my my thing, what I said. I want this car to, even in the winter with heat, I want to drive 200 kilometers. Not highway, so not highway speed. But that's it. But um, I'm, I will, will be very curious at 130 kilometers an hour what what range we get I'm guessing 180 and now 290 with 90 kilometers an hour we'll see we'll see we'll see it gets a bit warm in here now even turn off the heat a bit <laughs> many remoments on the chat <laughs> yeah you're all awake it's too cold there so you're 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 already awake and the other ones are in their warm bed oh <laughs> it's cute so Niata means hello in Romanian, Romanish. I don't know. I'm not good at that. Five C at nine A.M. We I'm ha having two C right now. Good morning. That's what did I say? Hello, yeah. Ninety-one percent. Yes, I'm from London, UK, but I've been Romanian many times. Nice country. I've never been. Our dog is from there. Still holding? I think so. So twenty five minutes. Sorry, I didn't see. Hello from Sweden, waiting for my ID3 to arrive in a few weeks' time. That's nice. The higher the speed, the less time it takes for the cabin to be heated. Why? <laughs> <coughs> yes, you got it right, Alexa. Good morning. Next week, I'm getting my ID3 also plus with a heat pump. Oh, you lucky bastard with a heat pump. I don't have a heat pump. When does the test start? It's already starting. <laughs> Can't you see? <laughs> Hello from Luxembourg. Cool. Uh, I'm charging to 100%. I'm at 91 and it's charging slow. Car says 20 minutes. Less time to have the heater on. <laughs> but then it's not warm. <laughs> yeah, it's not charging very strongly. I guess like 15 kilowatt or so, but the battery is cold. Good morning from the Netherlands. Still waiting to order a small battery ID3. So the 45 kilowatt, the pure. Depends what you need. Got mine last week. Max without heat pump. Max without heat pump. So in the, you're in the south of Europe, Spain, Portugal, something like this. Italy. Yeah, that's 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 shameful with the heat pump. It should have been in every ID3 first. Oh, did you buy a fast lane? Then you can select if you want heat pump or not, right? 92% I go check at the charging speed max without heat pump for Romanians only it's mean isn't it cold in Romania am I wrong in the winter I'm just thinking of Dracula and it's all 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 snow I could be wrong I'm sorry Sixteen kilowatt is our speed. Yeah, that's weird. First it oh, sorry. Every time. First edition Max in the Netherlands comes without heat pump. That's so mean. Hello from Romania. I have my ID3 for four weeks now, already experienced part of the interesting bugs, including battery drain. Appreciate your video is really insightful. Eh, going away. Inside for still an awesome car to drive. It's an awesome car to drive. They just need to update the stuff so it works properly like it should. Yeah, my Max doesn't have a heat pump. It's not the end of the world, but during winter we get temperature under zero degrees during the morning. Thankfully, I don't drive too many kilometers every day. Still, it, like I said, in all first editions there should have been heat pump. Or at least it can, that you can decide. Guten Morgen. Have a nice and safe trip. Thank you. 
they should provide heat pump for us also for everyone it should have been at least something that I can select if I want it any comment on the rumor about the big update being ready in December it's not a rumor not a rumor the big update will be implemented in December in the fast lane models and the 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 first edition models can then go to the update to the dealer uh, mid December January something like this it's not a rumor that's how it is ID4 looks awesome inside and out that's true outside it, it, I, I liked it better with the camouflage paint thing any comment oh, sorry I already said that sorry 56 people here 7 likes that's wrong likes 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 I'm a sucker for likes. Now oh, you want to see my beautiful view as always. Here. Yesterday climate control out of order. I hope the system will be upgraded properly. So did the climate break or was it just the bug and then when you let it sit it comes back? Or did it really break? I have to check my thing here comes off. Sounds weird, huh? <laughs> yeah, now it's, it's 23 degrees, it's warm in here. Bug. Yeah, when it, if it's a bug, then uh, let it stay, sleep, and then it will be fine. The sales dealer people in Sweden don't know anything about the big update being ready. Well, it's ready, they're just still testing it, and in a, in a few weeks it will come to you, and then you can, can have it. My backup camera is blank since two days now. Do you, did you get the update? Because there is one for the backup camera included. What about winter tires? Volkswagen dealer not having ready for order. I just ordered from a different tire dealer, waiting two weeks to be delivered. Yeah, I, I, the, the tires were no problem. It was the rims that I couldn't get. The Patrick, guten Morgen. <laughs> you have a nice day too. Good news, thanks. Greetings from Regensburg. Got this one. Germany here, Romania here, that's fun. Yeah, so I couldn't get the rims that I wanted on time, that's why I have the black rims now. You've seen the video. Do we know if the update will be deployed over the air or just at the dealer shop? The, this first update has to be at the dealer. With this update, then the over the air update module in the software is included. So far, it's not. So yes, you have to go to the dealer, there will be uh, many people waiting and it takes a day to do the update, so, and I'm pretty sure that it not, dealers cannot update like five, six cars, it will be one or maximum two, and so, and they don't have time all the time, it's a Volkswagen dealer, there are other cars <laughs> there too, so this will take time to update every car. 93%, 15 minutes, come on. Cool. Put on some music here. Let's have some music on, eh? Yeah, that's the problem with charging, eh? When you have to wait. Six more percent, I'm 94. It says 75 kilometers an hour charging. I, I never. <laughs> took the time to to write down what what that means at the charger in here so I would know I'm guessing it's now 14 kilowatt or so something like this lucky we have only two cars in the city unlucky that the dealer doesn't know about the updates huh very hard to find right size of tires a few developers only are making this one because it's a new electric car. Yeah, and, and the tires are not a problem, it's the rims. You have to be careful with the aftermarket, so third party rims, because the rims have to withstand way more weight in that size. Uh, I, I was told by Volkswagen, I don't know what the, what the name of that is, but it was 850 kilo that, that the wheel has to, I don't know, he told me, and you cannot just buy something somewhere 19 inch rims for a different card has to be because or 650 i think it was 650 this was it and a, a usual rim with a normal fossil car cannot withstand the 650 so you need a different rim different rims and then 
tires won't be a problem but also they have to withstand the weight of course it says I'm done at 913 you got right about the rims uh. rims are rated anyway that's true, the rims uh, they are rated for a special weight and then uh, I think it was 650 I don't know I can't remember uh. oh it's got later now <laughs> yeah does the end time go with the minutes or just with the time left huh. for weight uh. should I pee before we go I think I should pee before we go. Uh, it's still 15 minutes or 10. I'm guessing 10. A bit over 10. Yeah, I'll be back in a, in a second. I go pee. I go pee. Lock the car.
Get cold. Oh my. Freezing. Oh, it says three and a half degrees. I doubt that. Ninety-six percent. I don't think it's sixty-five. It's sixty-five kilometers an hour yet. It's fifteen kilowatt that it's charging. Ah. Anyone getting already a home charger from Moon? Isn't it the LA Fox one? are <laughs> waiting for mine. Hi Marty! Put a jacket on then. Yeah, I should have done that. I'm an idiot. In the car, they want to do that. They want to be comfortable. Get me some warm air in here and some seat heating. Oh, oh nice. Electric heater. Woo! Maybe I should do this. Maybe it's better. Now we close this. What's up, Chris? <laughs> Everything cool. What route have you planned? It's the same route as I did with the in the in the summer range test. So go direction of Dickendorf and then direction direction to Munich. But of course, I can't get that far with the temperatures, winter tires, and heat. Ninety-seven percent. Five minutes more. Uh, what is the number 20 all about? <laughs> I mean, I know. I'm so mean. I can just say it's it's something very nice. And, I, and I'm not allowed to talk about it yet. But it's nice. I get my IDC Tech next week, but winter tires in four weeks. Ooh, depends where you live. Do we need them right now? Then it's a problem. 97. I really want to charge you 100% till it's full. I charged you 100% this morning. Salzburg, ooh! <laughs> then you would have needed them a month ago. The beginning of, of November. Salzburg! Yeah, then you need them now. So, huh. Can you get rental ones from your dealer? Or something? Can you do anything? I mean, I had to change the, the rims that I wanted to get the winter tires now, and it's good. We also get our ID3 next Saturday in Dresden, but with winter tires. Which ones? Which winter tires are the rims? 18 inch steel, Loen, black, silver, or what else is there? Andoya. I think now it holds you. I have to check if everything is holding. Looks good. 18 aluminium. Which ones? I do you said 18 Loen silver. But that's weird. Um, if you're from Salzburg, contact the dealer uh, in uh, uh, here in Possa, Auto Röhr, Volkswagen Röhr. They have the, them in stock. The 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 Loen. I don't know. If it was the 18 inch. I know that they had the 19 inch on in stock. So silver and black. Is the white steering wheel hard to keep clean? No, not at all. I'm driving the car now for two months. I cleaned it once or twice. I have. Wipes, where are they? Leather wipes, and I, I, they were clean when I, you know, cleaned cleaned it off. And and, and even I'm weird because this is the position here. It's it it's the, the steering wheel is turned, where I hold the steering wheel 90%, and I don't see anything so far. Maybe I'm just blind. So far, I don't see anything really dirty. Or, or this color, man. maybe it is a bit, maybe it's just pressure because I'm, I'm holding it there, so I couldn't say. I have to, I have not fitted my winter ties in two years. Yeah, you, you lucky bastard. <laughs> 98, 98%, soon we're done and then we can go to reset all my trips. I want to reset the, the, the trip meter too, so the just the floor is dirty. <laughs> yeah, it's dirty in here as, as usual. I'm not good with that. I know. Yes. Is this genuine leather? Yes, yeah, sadly. I wanted vegan leather, but they don't provide that yet. They will do that hopefully soon. My stock here is dirty. 
it's a bit dusty in here. What's good with uh, the outside is dirty too, of course. Uh, what's good with the white interior, so on the door and, and here in front, the light gray, that you don't see dust as much. So f way in the front here, it's not even that dusty as I thought. Getting an ID3 in Scotland in a few weeks, most of us do, no bother with winter tires in Scotland, should be okay if careful. Okay, it all depends on the on the law. So here in Germany, um, you don't have to have winter tires on at all, but if there's an accident and people, uh, and, and they see that because you didn't drive with winter tires, this is why the accident was worse or happened, then you're in trouble and insurance doesn't pay. I'm also very satisfied with the white steuerung wheel. Schmutz! <laughs> no schmutz! <laughs> oh, still 98%. Almost done. Come on, it says five minutes. Oh. Is there a piano black where the cup holders are? Yes, there is. And this looks. Not nice. I should get my cleaning thing. Where did I put that? Still have a few minutes. Where is that thing? I had that cleaning glove that Volkswagen gave me. There it is. Haha. It, it comes from that disinfectant. When you press the disinfectant a few times. By the way, I got the OBD11, but it doesn't work. I can't connect to it with my phone. Nothing happened. And I contacted them already and they have no idea why and I said to they send it back. I had a different OBD and that didn't didn't recognize the ID3. No, it's all clean almost. I tried a bit Look at this thing here. Ninety-nine percent, almost done. And then it's in a little pouch. <laughs> so necessary here. Eh? And I got this from 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 the my car dealer where I bought the car. So with three thingies to go shopping. Is there any car with piano black steering wheel? <laughs> yeah, Jill has that. Jill has the car with piano black. Okay, put this back. The mask is here too, 99% almost done. Cindy wrote, what did Cindy say? Just say hello, that's nice. Microphone here and weird hair underneath. Should be done soon. Does the white steering wheel not get a bit dirty after some time? I have it for two months and so far not, but I try to stay clean. So when I'm eating or something, I try not to touch the steering wheel. And I don't have a dirty job, so I'm not working with oil or, or grease or anything. And so far, it's, it's possible that it changed color there where I touch it all the time. I can see that there are dents from, 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 from the grip, I guess. I don't know. But I don't see any discoloration so far. Still 99%. Should be done in a second. I have to reset all the trips. Let's go to vehicle, interior, cockpit. You should eat some Doritos for the... <laughs> yeah, that's true. <laughs> I should do that. Oh, charging stopped. We're full. Can you say once again which software version you have right now also for navigation? I can do that. Where is it? Voice control, reconnect, system information. I have software 0570, navigation database is 20.9, that's it. <coughs> so 
some pluck. Range is 270 kilometers at full battery. It's not a lot. <laughs> so, now I have this. I'm in D. See, cruise control works. That's fine. Which one Renault Zoe 135 BMW? Huh? No, I, it says in the title ID3. <laughs> That's what we're driving now. Yeah, yeah. Music off. Wanna reset all my trip. So since start reset, long term reset, trip recorder reset. Check it out. All reset. Trip recorder also reset. So let's go. I still love driving this car so much. So much. Start time is 9.16, yeah, but it's not about time. It's about range, so kilometers. There we go, set to 93. Turn lane assist off. Nobody needs that. Yeah, we have trucks, but uh, because it's Saturday, but only uh, so this should be over in uh, when we're in Dickendorf, 30 kilometers. How much data do you have to live stream all the time? Well, I, I, I buy. I buy a day, a day plan where I can ha <coughs> have unlimited data. So from when did I start? 8:30 or so till tomorrow. 8:30. See, the sun is already coming out up there. Could be bad because maybe I, I need less heat. Ooh, that looks nice. With the, it was just the fog was just around the the Danube. Oh, that's nice. But minus 0 0.5 degrees, car says. Yeah, I don't know if this 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 outside temperature of the ID3 is that accurate. It, it jumps around a lot, and then we, it shows. So it shows uh, two degrees to get out of the car, and then it says five degrees, and then it goes down again. So that's weird. Not it's not perfect. I do my introduction of the video. We did a little video of the start. That's good. Yeah, yeah. I so need travel assist for my tests. <laughs> Otherwise, I don't need it. Pardon? I didn't talk to you. Thing came up. Hello, yes. Hello, yes. Works too. Yeah, I'm not good with that. And now a bit more. Even a bit more. That's good. I am on my way. 93 kilometers uh, on the cruise control. I charged to 100%. Already 99 because I already drove a kilometer or so and that's that's just normal I did a reset but this just is counting down but I did a reset on the long term as well so to have two just to be sure and I reset even my uh, trip meter so I can see 100 meters as well and we have seen in the video where I did the winter tire consumption that the, the distance was spot up 
exactly what what uh, Google Maps says. Huh? I have 270 kilometers of range, and this is all just because of the heat. Because if I turn off the heat, it's at 23 and a half degrees. Boop. Now at 305. Boop. Back on. It's even more now. <laughs> Less now than it was before. Okay. Uh, my these are my settings. So this is how I drive. So just the uh, driver is being heated that's why it says eco on the right side if the seat heater on two I will change that if it gets too warm uh, and, and change the temperature according to that too uh, I just want to be comfortable live stream is going uh, the fog where I was charging was just there because there's the Danube now it's nice and uh, nice and sunny and it's way better but cold Courses minus 0 0.5 degrees. We'll see. That was the video. The truck is getting closer, but he's not that fast. Did I record? Yeah, I think so. With time. Did I? I have to check. <laughs> I'm bad with that. Yes, I did. Oh, cool. Okay. Uh, light winds here, almost no wind. Does your ISV have the heat pump fitted? No, I have normal PTC heater. It takes a lot of power. <laughs> From Marco. <laughs> Thank you. Let's have some music. You don't hear the music that loud anyways, huh? With the microphone fitted. Yeah, the microphone for my live stream was a great decision. Sound is better, it's a bit louder. And uh, the outside noise or, or music doesn't bug you that much. Yeah, I'm slowing down because there's a Tesla overtaking me. Also very slow. <laughs> it's cute. Yeah, it's cute. Von Regensburg, a P85. Yeah, I'm driving 100 to pass the truck. Oh my, oh my. There's another truck, damn it. Yeah, but this will take another 10 minutes to get there. I'm by the truck. There's someone coming in the back. Let's steadily go down. Ooh, great song. <coughs> Back to our normal speed. Yes. Yeah, we haven't had a, lo a longer trip in the ID3 for a while, huh, you guys? Yeah, and I was looking forward to that. Why is the truck now coming closer? Doesn't make sense. Truck is really coming closer than I just passed. What the hell? Maybe because it's downhill. people nobody's commenting can you see the truck coming look at that can you see no you can't see it here not need it turn it off
Greetings from Finland. Greetings from Germany. 12 kilometers driven. Consumption is high, but it was just uphill. Now it's downhill finally. Truck is getting a bit back. Hopefully it's changed his speed. did something. Let it roll downhill or something. Save gas. How is everybody with the stupid corona crap? Everybody okay? Healthy? Where's Chill? <laughs> I miss Chill. <laughs> He's never in the live stream anymore. Not on Sunday, not on Saturday. He has stuff to do. Hopefully he's okay. Or his family. I, I emailed him on, on Patreon once, and he, he, he emailed back that he's fine and better. made for slipstreaming. What does slipstreaming mean? Okay, till now. <laughs> deal with the, the, the noise I'm sorry a lot of power in a car is nice and it's fun but but uh, and I'm okay when you when you give it the beans that it's loud but some some high power cars they're loud all the time you start them it many have a button to make it even louder for, for the exhaust to go open it's just annoying waiting for a vaccine yeah just destroys a lot of plans. Makes everything harder. You have to pass this truck soon. So far, no slowing down. <laughs> the, the road is not wet, it's just the, 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 the dampness of the frozen. I think I pass him now. There's nobody behind me for a second. Accelerate 200. Oh, there's someone coming. No. That's it. I did it. Let's go slowly back to our 93. Moin, moin. Best weather. Yeah, it's a nice weather today. That's true. But zero degrees. <coughs> I'm in a good mood. <laughs> that's unusual. <laughs> yeah, that's fun. Oh, come on. No, not like this. Well, yeah, downhill, the trucks always go faster.
Yeah, you don't want to know the average consumption because it's not. Co you can't believe the number since I'm, I was doing uphill for the first 10 kilometers. It's 215 right now, but it's going down. Another hip pump question. Could for be richer fit your car with it? Thanks and stay safe. I doubt it. I really doubt it. It's just too. Maybe it's possible somehow, but it just costs way too much. Woohoo! Truck behind me is passing a different truck, so I can go by with my 93. Or now he's not passing. Damn it! I have to accelerate a bit. I take an EAP. Go take an EAP. EAP rules. It's a fun car to drive. It's just not enough range for me. Like I always said, for me, electric car minimum is. 200 kilometers of range in the winter on the country road with heat on and winter tires and everything and we'll see today because that's what I need I want to drive at least 200 kilometers with this car then I'm fine he up in January cool that's good you're lucky that you got one yeah good song <laughs> good music did the synth charge work too? Yes. All my trips work. 22 kilometers so far, so nothing. What's this uh, state of charge? 93! Only 7%. Of course I heated up the car before I drove. Nobody, nobody takes a long trip and doesn't heat up the car before at home while charging. It's just stupid. You take too much power. Stream is 720p, but picture is blurry, grainy, much vibration. I, should, I, I tried to fix it harder. Is it better now? It's not blurry in my view here. I think it's the connection, not the camera. Well, it could be both. <laughs> if it's blurry, then it's the connection. What does my connection say? I can't even see. It's black. It's stupid. <laughs> it seems like 340p on a 720p stream. Yeah, sorry. That's all I can do. Can change that. I'm using the best data provider in the area of Germany. That's all I can do. Picture is good enough for more. <laughs> yeah, 4G should be better. It should be at least 1080p live stream. That should work. Yeah, so I would think another 15 kilometers or 20 and then I'm going on a different highway and there there won't be any trucks so it's and less busy, it's good. And then I go, so go in the direction of Munich and then maybe go around Munich, we'll see how far I can get. Like I said, I'm guessing 280 kilometers. Oh yeah. Good. Where did I drive by an electric vehicle? This is a test. Come on. Oh cool. Still 92%. Wanna see when we are at 100? Uh, at, at, at 90? Well, that's interesting then. I'm getting a bit hungry here. I should eat something. Uh, first drink. What's the real maximum speed? Well, speedometer says 166. It should be around 162. GPS speed.
Or do you mean if it's not limited, software limited, if you would remove the limiter? <laughs> I'm guessing a lot. I would say 220? With that power? 200 horsepower? Sorry, the noise. Trying to open something to eat. I always eat the same thing, and then there's salt everywhere. I think I lost your answer, the connection wasn't good. What was the question? Sorry. Can you repeat the question for me? Good in! Hello, Bitrip! Where's Paolo? I don't see your question. Where's Paolo? Huh. Wanna interview me for magazine, sure? <coughs> we can do that. Sure. Just uh, uh, write me an email, that's the best. Um, there's a... When you go on, on the YouTube channel at the end, you can select a, a contact or something. And there's my email address. For the channel. You people don't get it, huh? The same with Bjorn. The 90 kilometers an hour test has nothing to do that people don't drive 90 on the on the highway. The 90 kilometer test is the perfect test with consumption how people drive in normal use, which means city, country, and a tiny bit of highway. That's what it does. And so, and that's why when Björn and I are doing the 90 kilometers an hour consumption and range test, this comes extremely close. Wow, so many trucks going off here. This comes extremely close to the WLTP test. That's why you do that. You do the normal use of an EV and so you get an, an accurate number. You can just drive 40 kilometers in, in the city and then 20 on the, on the country road and 10 on the highway. It's just hard to do because every city is different. Maybe you have to wait on the light. And so to drive it on the highway at constant speed simulates the normal consumption. And then 130, the test that we'll be doing after this, is then if it's really just highway, if you have to go somewhere. So the daily use range, if you just go to work, which usually is in a town. And some, con some countries have 100 or 110 kilometers an hour speed limit on the highway so the average is 90 no problem to film. Hello, yes. Hmm. 
Okay, I watched this at 90%. I, I missed <laughs> missed it by a few seconds at 89. And it's 36 kilometers, so it was 33, 34 at 90%. Uh, that would mean 340 kilometers, but I doubt that. <laughs> Consumption is going down, but I can see it here. It is around 18, 18 to 20 but it, it's hard to say with the instant consumption and, and this we'll see when we turn around and I never know it, it's so different sometimes when I turn around it gets higher the consumption sometimes gets lower we'll see I have to switch highways soon oh I will uh, notice you when I'm at 25% used What did I see? Did I see Mr. Morgenthal? Good morning! How are you? In those moments I would love to be able to speak Dutch or... What do you feel in... What do you say in Belgium? I have no idea. <laughs> are we there yet? Are we there yet? Yes we are. You are there yet. Good morning and don't forget to leave a like. <laughs> this is the way it is. That's a name, huh? Are we there <laughs> How are you, Jill? Everything cool? You're healthy? Family's healthy? We worry. You're never on the live stream again, uh, anymore. We speak Belgian? Okay. We have to change highway in a second. And I can't forget. <laughs> that would be nice. Everybody healthy. That's good. I'm so happy. Yeah, we we you're just you're just busy these days, huh? Don't hear that much of you anymore. Sad. <laughs> Hello from England. Excellent channel. Thank you. Extremely. Thank you very much. Any news on full software update? Software is done. Um, Fastlane ID3 models get it first in from mid December on, and then the the first edition models get it from beginning of of uh, January. Winter range test. What the temperature outside? It's two degrees right now. It was. Minus one when I started, or minus 0 0.5. No, seriously, French is my native language. Bonjour, that's all I can. You should have noticed when we had Patreon call. That's true, but I forget, you know me. I forget everything. I'm very forgetful. I'm horrible. I forget names, details, at work. Oh my God, I have no idea why they employ me. I forget everything. Is your ID3? Uh, the uh, one with heat pump. No! Mine does not have a heat pump. And that's bad. It's a lot of, of energy for heating. Yeah. You're changing highway here. It's fantastic to hear. I'm looking forward to the extra features. Stay safe on the roads. I don't think it will be that many features. I think it's more about that the car works. <laughs> there will be features, of course, Apple CarPlay and so on. But I, I don't need them. I, I just want the car to work normally. Are we going to, to the mountain today? No, I can't. The, the, the area where I usually go to the mountains, Berchtesgaden, is in lockdown. Nobody can get in without a mm, sun in the face, without a special reason. I mean, I have a special reason, but I don't get anything. <coughs> Look at him, he's all happy he's passing an ID3. Drive in D. Am I still in eco? Yes, I'm in eco mode. I should say that in the next video. Oh my god. 
really bad. I'm glad that my iNOIC has heat pump. Yeah, I would love to have heat pump as well, but for the plus, when I ordered it, it wasn't available. I know you doesn't have heat pump, but are you not testing one with heat pump this weekend? No, tomorrow. So tomorrow, uh, a very nice guy will meet me in Straubing and we're gonna do consumption tests each other and he has a max but with the same winter tires that I have that's the whole test that's tomorrow he will, we will meet at 10 a.m. and then charge a bit talk a bit film a bit and then do a clean run without heat or maybe maybe the other way around we'll see you are locking you are locking down nature what the heck yeah <laughs> Heat pump, that's my nickname. <laughs> we missed you so much. Where's Darren? He's, he's live streaming himself. <laughs> Uploading all those Christopher Berg videos. It's so cute. It is such a big fan of Christopher Berg. I find it amazing. Oh, what tires he have Leon. He has the same as me, the Leon 19 inch in black. Darren is uploading video. <laughs> he has no time for this. Yeah, some people are already getting their Andoya now, but I didn't get them. But now that I think of it, I think uh, I, I don't love the looks of the Lewin tires that I have right now. Have you seen Darren's first videos? Yeah, they were really creepy with him testing out the, the, the streaming. Oh my god not saying anything just looking with his glasses it was just so weird um, but uh, after a while with the, the winter tires I, 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 I think it would have been boring if the car would look the same the whole year now it looks different every six months and I got used to it now we have a bit more usable consumption 187 watt hours per kilometer is the consumption in the summer it was 129 given the popularity of the subject I suggest changing the name of the channel to battery life without heat pump <laughs> that's good battery life with piano black and without Darren yeah He's the best. Darren rules. Where are we? 86%. I think we can go farther than I thought. I really expected 292 was my my calculation. Would be amazing if we can do 300 kilometers in the winter. Bjorn has new pants? Oh my god! Maybe his winter pants. And the, the, the big white MC Hammer pants <laughs> uh, where his, his summer pants. Maybe switch to winter now. It was really white, yeah. He loves those white pants. It looks so weird, a tiny Chinese guy with white pants. They look, they, they are 20 sizes too big for him. You should open a shop with pants. <laughs> you do a charging test between both the cars tomorrow. See if there are differences in heating of the battery. There won't be any difference. The Max and Plus is the exact same car except for some hardware features. Battery for all first editions and fast lane models, it's exactly the same. But you mean with the, the heating up with the heat pump. Um, so of the battery, I, I I don't know if the the heat pump is even the thing that heats up the battery in the max. Thai, not Chinese. Did I say Chinese? I'm sorry. The heat pump warms the battery. Yeah, I don't think it it, it, it makes a bit of a big difference. And he comes from far away. He he will be driving three four hundred kilometers. His battery will be warm. And who wants a cold battery anyway? Cold battery sucks. 50 kilometers. And we are at 85%. That means 300, over 300 kilometers. Huh. Cool. 
What do you all know? <laughs> Vienna black can be covered in most places inside and in bloody shouldn't aid it. <laughs> Who is Björn and Darren? Tell us we are new to the channel. You don't know Björn Nieland? Björn Nieland has the biggest EV channel on YouTube. Over 200,000 subscribers now. So 20 times as much as I have. So you should know him. And Darren is a subscriber and a patron of mine. He has 11 subscribers. <laughs> Darren is, is the core of this channel. There are only a few people, I would say 10. And I think all of them, oh, most of them are patrons also. So they, they rule. Which EV you drove in the past month, years, did you like the most? The one I'm sitting in right now. It's two. But just because of money. Uh, the, the Jaguar I-Pace was also a lot of fun. It has way more power with the all-wheel drive and 300 kilowatt. But I didn't like how you interact with the car and the screens. So yes, no, it's this one. Many people here in Norway complain about charge speed even after driving far before charging. Every ID3 in Norway has heat pump. This is why it would be interesting test. Oh. Yeah, sorry, I don't... I, I, I really think his battery will be warm. We should do a manual for new people. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> If Wikipedia for excuse would be good. <laughs> yeah, Wikipedia page. And then if somebody asks a question, hello, what are you doing? And then check the Wikipedia page. We don't talk to you anymore. <laughs> that is fun. Yeah, the sun uh, is, is warming me a bit, so that's bad that I can turn the heat a bit down. It shouldn't be. If there wouldn't be any sun, I would have the heat on 24, now I have it 22 and a half. I can write thousand page manual and you can make an epic video. <laughs> 500 kilometers driving and cold battery on ID3. Well, depends how you drive. If you drive with 90 and don't accelerate and the battery is, is, is mine at, at zero degrees, it won't heat up. Especially now, right now, the battery heater works, but for example, navigation to uh, uh, Georgia doesn't work yet that it preheats the car they should will come uh, battery this will come with the update and <clears throat> it says that if you preheat the car so with the app or anything that the battery should be heated I don't think that's working right now but it certainly pre uh, heats up the car with charging and while charging so I, I plugged in a few weeks ago when I did the I did a live stream when I did the, the, the heat consumption test with the summer tires and it was two degrees. I plugged it in. I was driving with 90 kilometers an hour. Ooh, there's an ID3 on the other. No, no, it's a Model 3. Model 3 in white. Cute. Um, and I started at three or four percent or 6%, I can't remember. And uh, it, it started with 70 kilowatt, but then it heated up the battery, I could see it, and then it was 100 kilowatt. So it worked for me. Hi, outside temperature 10 degrees, battery heating does not work at all. Maybe it, maybe it doesn't, and I'm just wrong. <laughs> maybe it just heated up the battery with charging. Hi, does your 12 volt monitor give you a warning via app, so you do have to, to keep checking any news on Corsa E? No, my 12 volt battery monitor is just with uh, Bluetooth and so I only see the voltage when I'm close to the car. Otherwise I don't see it, but I see a graph afterwards. And Corsa E, no, Opel, I emailed Opel this year, I would say five, six times and different people at Opel and, and uh, emailed them in end of October with the new subscriber count and videos where I had a lot of views, but no reply at all. They don't care. It's Darren and his white M3. Get him. That's true. 
Oh my, that's painful. People do not know Darren. Hopefully, they know me when I'm gone. That's true. Hello from Japan. 1800 kilometers an hour in Japan. People most mostly drive in the speed on highways. Interesting test. That's good. That's good. 82% now. Our average consumption is 188. We drove 59 kilometers. Average speed is 88. So that's pretty good. The average speed consumption is high. I'm at 22 and a half degrees heat just for the driver. But uh, no seat heater. Well, it doesn't consume anything from the battery anyways. Uh, the sun is shining in my face here on the left. That warms me up a bit. That's why it's in 22 and a half. 110 people, only not even 60 likes. Wrong. <laughs> Come on, like people. Like, 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 like. I will say like until we reach 70. Like, 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 like. Like, 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 come on, like, like, 65, like, 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 <laughs> things can th things that make me happy. I'm in a good mood today. I don't know why. I mean, I fell asleep yesterday before 8 a.m. We we took a bath in the evening and then I just fell asleep. 90 kilometers an autobahn in 2020. Face palm car future. You ugh, again. You guys don't get it. <laughs> the same in when the first video with the ID3. 90 kilometers an hour. I already said it today. The 90 kilometers an hour on the highway has nothing to do that this is how you should drive. <laughs> I'm getting mad now. M good mood is over. Um, the 90 kilometers an hour constant speed test on the highway and going in one direction and then landing on the, uh, the same spot where you started is just to, to simulate the normal use of a car. The normal use every day. You go to work do groceries and stuff like this. You go in a city, you go a bit country road, you go a bit highway, and that 90 kilometers an hour represents that. That's how it is. I will do a different test just for highway 130. It has nothing to do with face palm and car of the future. <laughs> the max speed on high, and, and that's true. On, on many European countries, you can't go faster than 100 or 110. And then your average speed minus 88 kilometers an hour right now. X are optimal charging curve. Red ones are with heat pump. Blue ones without. I don't know what you're talking about. Did I miss something? What you said? Ciao from Italy. Just ordered my 500e yesterday. Cool. You have. A, I'm in contact with Spia to get a 500e to to drive. And then when your battery is empty, you go charge your car and it cold gates because you didn't drive 130 on the highway. That's true. <laughs> That's how it will be. Thought I guess people do not know what chair video is. Yes, they don't. You are happy because I'm back. That's true. I'm really happy because you're back. I haven't heard from you in two weeks or so, except for the Patreon message. This was about a link on diagram above. Perhaps the link got suppressed. Yeah, you cannot post links in the YouTube chat. They will be deleted right away. I, I, I don't do that. That's what that YouTube does that. Polo 1.6 TDI faster than Tesla Model S from city to city. Of course. That's normal. Every every ICE car that has can drive 400 kilometers is faster at, at, at the, your tar, uh, destination than an electric car. If the Electric car has to charge in between. It's just normal. There's nothing special about it. And who cares if it takes longer? It's not about that. No, that is not how it should be. Car advertised with 100 kilowatt charging and battery heating. Well, if they don't, it's the same with Model 3. If you get the Model 3 and you drive slow and you don't navigate to a charger, then the battery doesn't heat up. Wow, look at the big bird. Cool. Big thing. 
But no, of course, it would be it would be fun if they would implement a, a, a button that you press and the battery gets heated up. But you have to think, a battery, what is it, 400, 500 kilos, till this heats up from zero degrees, that takes a while. To take range test, now a charging test. I will charge, wow, angry Chris, can you do a test at 112 kilometers an hour? And then afterwards at 113. Yeah. I mean, of course, I will charge when we go back and I want to see how the charging speed is. And I'm guessing uh, that charging will heat up the battery and I'm guessing we will start not with 100 kilowatt, but we will get 100 kilowatt. That's what I think. At least they could add a battery temp monitor. No EV has that, only in special apps and with o OBD dongles and stuff like this. Did I even record? Yes, I did. Where are we? 79%. I'm guessing Bjorn is slightly biased against BMW i3. He keeps moaning about minor stuff like adaptive cruise control, camera, and stuff. Do not use Eco Pro mode in his range test. Well, he, he in his range tests he never does drive in, e, in 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 the most efficient thing. He wants the climate to be on. I I turn climate off in my range test except for now because it's a winter range test. Come on, drive. Drive, crucifix, drive, stupid Mercedes. Yeah, he got the memo. And I, I watched the i3 videos. I didn't see anything that was weird about it. I mean, yes, he complains when something doesn't work. I would do the same thing if the adaptive cruise control doesn't work just because it's raining or there's sun. I would be mad too. He loves the charging and everything. And it's, it is outdated, come on, if you don't have a touch screen and you have to put in your address in a weird way. Battery heating will cost around 3 kilowatt hours in my opinion, estimated from all three values. That's okay, as long as you get fast charging speed. What average watt hours per kilometer right now? 187. We drove 69 kilometers. Hello from Melbourne, Australia. Looking forward to the day ID3 and ID4 arrives down under. <laughs> um, me too. Don't get angry, Chris. Some people dislike EV, but they also have to accept that EV or the future. <laughs> Nissan Leaf has battery temperature display and speedometer. Yeah, but it doesn't show what exact temperature that it is. It's just a, a bar, and then you have to estimate where it it's, uh, replicates and where not. You should buy SUV. Who agrees with me? <laughs> the Taycan shows battery temp on the instrument class. That's true. I was wrong. You're totally right. The, the Taycan does that. <laughs> now everybody's coming. MX30 has temperature monitor. You're totally wrong. <laughs> yeah, well, I, I, I stay. What is it? Corrected. I'm, I'm stupid. Then I apologize. ID3 doesn't, and it, I don't think they would implement it because Volkswagen they want uh, <laughs> get mad at me. You're totally right. <laughs> I will get mad at me too. I'm horrible saying stuff that's not even true. Do I know anything? Answer is no. I don't know anything. Chris is biased towards Hyundai. Hyundai. Yeah, I like it. Someone complained why I didn't buy the I, uh, the, the Kona, why I bought the stupid ID3. And I tried to explain that yes, Kona has a lot of things that I love. Regen. That's the only thing that's better than ID3 but how it drives how it behaves while driving steering wheel feel is and comfortability and quietness I just love it so much here in the ID3 two main things will be heat pump and temp monitor yes we need that well at least pressing a button so it heats up the battery and tells me how long it will take or navigate to IoT and then it does it something like this yeah, the, the 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 i3 with the no touch screens and wheel and touchpad. That's just weird. That's 
so outdated. The MX-32 in 2020, even in 2018 without a touchscreen, that shouldn't work. If I had a temp gauge, you could at least see that you had to drive a bit hard before charging. But okay, yeah, it, it, you're right. It would be nice, but I, I doubt that they will implement it. But I would love to have that too. I would love to have all the numbers, how much the heat is taking, the temperature of the battery, what, what the cooling of the battery, the heating of the battery takes. I would want to have that all. You know, magic has... <laughs> That's true. <laughs> Jill, you're totally back. I love it. You can moan, it's okay. I will not moan anymore about it. You can moan, it's fine. Just frustrating after paying 45,000 euros for a car. <laughs> yeah, I get it. Ooh, sun will be gone, it's foggy. Maybe I need more heat. Turn it up to 23 and a half. Let's do 23 first. Great morning, you, yay. Marty and Jill. Oh, no light. I need lights. Ooh, by the way, I found a, a button in the in the You can select uh, um, when the, the auto light comes on. So how dark it has to be. I think it's uh, early. And what else? Where is it? Headlights. Switch on time. Early, medium and late. I have it on early, so when it's a tiny bit dark, you should already turn on the the lights. I love that. You're at work, Marty? I'm so sorry. That's not good. I thought you were a bus driver. Was I wrong? How can you watch a live stream then? Was I, if I was wrong, I apologize. You know me, I forget everything. I am. <laughs> and so, when you're driving, you're, you're watching a live stream, or just listening to a live stream? <laughs> Are you sure you should do that? <laughs> Ooh, we had 76%. I have to film soon when we had 75. Multitasking photo <laughs> in, says a public bus driver. It's awesome. I love that. Fuck, uh, screw uh, safety. <laughs> That's the stuff. Hello, sound works. Let's see what do we have. I need a bit less. Still at seventy-six percent. Yeah, it is multitasking for the way. Oh god, you guys are so funny. I missed you. I missed a long live stream where I have time. I used to think touchscreen is the best thing ever. Now I have to switch between ice car with an i3 and without it, not care much. Well, if you don't do anything with the touchscreen, if you don't have to change settings, then it's fine. And it is. In some, there are many settings that I would love a real button. 75%. Hey, we are 75%. 79 kilometers. We have to calculate. 79 times 4 is 316. Yes. Uh, consumption 187. Average speed is perfect. That's what I imagine for, for a drive like this. The sun is gone now. There's fog. My heat is on 23 degrees, still eco. Maybe I turn it up a tiny bit, just a fan. And like I said, I adjust that I'm comfortable. <laughs> I did it. Now oh, come on. Microphone doesn't turn off. There we go. We did it. Uh, I need music. It's weird in here.
Why would anyone buy a BMW in 2020? <laughs> yeah, the, the, the front of the car, yes, you have to like it that you have such a big grill, even on I-4 or on IX-3. What change of weather? Yes, that came abruptly from sun to fog like this. And it's zero degrees, the fog brings cold. What's the destination today? No destination. I just drive in one direction to 55%, turn around and go back to the beginning. Thanks for the videos. My ID3 gets delivered next week. Thank you for watching, James. What's the what's the price start for ID3 in Germany? 35,000 euros and then without incentives, what is that, 26? Uh, that's the turnaround point today at 55%. I'm, I'm, I'm at 74. We've driven 83 kilometers. So I'm guessing in another 80 kilometers or so. No, less. 75. 70. I don't know. <laughs> Can you hear that? Cindy and her dad doing. Cindy is doing fine. Her dad is doing horrible. Not long. That's all I'm saying. Not nice. And it's horrible that she can't visit him. Well, she can, but it's too risky right now. Nobody knows what will happen in the next weeks. Maybe she has to stay in Canada, can't get back to Germany, or can't get away from the airport. Who knows? Or risky for him, risky for us. Not good. Looks as objective. I find the i3, especially front, beautiful, and all Korean EVs except Seoul just horrid in reality. Kona looks nice in pictures and bits only. I checked the weather, it's gonna be sunny in a few kilometers. <laughs> Thank you! That's nice. Yeah, of course, looks are always objective. That's just how it is. But uh, the, what he th he meant with how can you buy a BMW in 2020 is the big grill, which means a, a horrible uh, drag coefficient. That means as an EV, not a very good consumption. And ID3 is not that much. Uh, ID3 is better, but not like Model 3 or or Model S, where the the car was just designed for great drag. So not a lot of wind uh, air resistance. And if you have such a big grill, like on the i4, it's you just know the same with the Audi e-tron. This will be a, a high-consumption EV, and it needs a big battery. Let's see if it's really sunny, uh, sunny in a few kilometers. By the way, when I turn off the light in and I put it in auto, the uh, lights don't don't go on, so it's too bright. Where are we? 73%. Oh, cool. Where's the bathrobe? At home. I was wearing it this morning. I get up with my pajamas and put on a rope <laughs> because it's cold. Hello from Romania. Another one. We have like four people from Romania here. Or maybe the other one's already left. We're here in the beginning at 9 a.m., so an hour ago. Oh, and my back hurts, and it's not the seats, it's work. At work, I'm in a warehouse, and it's busy since beginning of October. I have to carry a lot of packages, and I notice my back. I'm old. Ooh, a truck. The first truck since we're on the highway to Munich. Hello from windy Croatia. Hello. No wind here. That's good. I'm here. Yeah, still here. That's good. I heard that the Model 3 makes a lot more noise on the highway than the ID3. That's true. 
and Nissan Leaf was was exceptionally loud in my opinion at, at very high speeds at 100 it was fine at 130 yeah on the edge at 160 Leaf, the Leaf E plus was horribly loud and Model 3 is louder but if it doesn't bug you it's fine I love that the ID3 is even at 130 and 160 quiet extremely stable even with the winter tires I loved it you should have the massage seats <laughs> um, I didn't choose the max for many reasons and I made a video about it why not I would have loved the heat pump I have nothing against having the, the head-up display that would be nice I don't need the panoramic roof and I didn't want the 20 inch wheels and especially the rims I hated the rims of the max so much for the summer tires that I didn't want the car just because of that and I don't have another 1800 euros lying around to change the tires afterwards when I get the car and there was something else yeah I don't need the, the wireless charging uh, the, the problem with the electric seats would have been okay but not necessary that much it's mostly me driving or mostly 99.9% um, the, the problem with the electric seats in the ID3 is that it has that thing that goes longer and I think that the seats overall is a tiny bit longer than what I have in here it looks like it and then Cindy couldn't drive even less good night from California all the best for your drive Chris thanks Ron B nice nice and warm in California love to be there right now to finish off the discussion about the looks Volkswagen did a great job styling ID3 it's both modern and conservative at the same time I think so too I, I still not a fan of the black you know the thing right and after the windshield I think that the Seat Elborn or Cooper Elborn looks better without it do you think a heat pump would make a big difference for your range? We'll find out tomorrow. Do a range test with a Max with the same winter tires. He has a heat pump, I don't. And we drive two hours and then at 90 kilometers an hour uh, from Straubing to this direction. And then I want to see uh, what his consumption and his range left is or where his state of charge is and where mine is. I'm just saying, I'm just on how late it was to start. I wonder where you start, 9.15? Morning, Chris. Hey, Darren is here. Since you don't have your normal pictures, nobody know, knows you anymore. You have to change it back. <laughs> we need Darren. to do Darren of batteries. I have to accelerate to 100 kilometers an hour. Ooh, there's someone coming from the back. Ooh, he's coming fast. Oh, no, 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 no. Almost. Almost, almost, ah, he's coming fast. Yeah, this this road here is horrible with BMWs driving like crazy. When, when are we starting tomorrow? I'll meet with him at 10 a.m. Um, and then we have to talk a bit. Uh, and then what we'll, we're doing, then film a bit the beginning. Then we do a test drive. I want to see if there's a difference in consumption if we just drive without the heat oh god come on Audi he has to accelerate come on go good now he found the, the gas pedal is it a Mercedes not an Audi I was wrong and then then we start so I would think I would start I will start the stream after we did the introduction video when we do start with the driving so I would say 1030 1045 <laughs> BMW is fresh from Dingerfield plant now there was an old one but we are at BMW right now here on the left that's all BMW or is it maybe I'm wrong maybe it was already I am, I'm stupid but this was an old one oh it gets a bit warm my son comes out my husband drives a BMW I will drive an ID3 <laughs> You have to bet a car. <laughs> I'm at 70% of the 96 kilometers. We'll see at 67 if we are at 100. That would be amazing. Then I can drive above 300 kilometers. I didn't expect that. Consumption is high at 187. I was expecting that. 
but I was expecting less range. Car says 298 kilometers of range. That would mean 295. Oh, it would be amazing if we can do 300. I can't remember. Oh, I planned 10 minutes, kilometers ago. Thank you for letting me know. What tire pressure are you riding? What brand of tire? Uh, I made a video about the tires, winter tire consumption test. There you can see Continental something, 19 inch. It's 2.5 bar on all four. That's the maximum that it says here on the door. I'm not putting more in there. Are you in your bathrobe? Of course. What else would I be wearing in the car? According to your battery status, your turnaround point is gonna be around München Flughafen. That's possible. But like I said, I turn around at 55%, not 50. Um, yeah, West, 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 what is it? Type X or what is his name? With all his stats and calculation. <laughs> People have other stuff to do. I look forward to your test tomorrow in the Netherlands. The heat pump is around 1300 euros option, so I'm still in doubt if I should get it. Here too, it's 1250, I think. Germany. I would have wanted it, I would have paid for it gladly. Because I do very long trips, and then if you have 50 kilometers more range on a full battery, that's nice. But it's loud. So the, the, this heater right now, it's extremely quiet. Even when you preheat the car, you can barely hear it. That's nice. Yeah, the sun is warm here in my face. That's why I'm only at 22 and a half degrees. I can even put it to 22. Yeah, that's, that's not perfect for the test. I wanted it to be cold. It is zero degrees, but the, the, I don't need it as warm since the sun is warming me up. I would have wanted that to be cold all day for to see real winter consumption. Oh, it's a great song too. Yeah. That's the ugliest car in the world with this plastic stuff on the side. I'm sorry. This and that, that one, is it a Land Rover? No, I don't know what it is. Uh, um, which is an SUV and you can, and it looks like it's being squashed. And it, and it has, it, there's even a, a convertible version of a half SUV crossover. Those are the two ugliest cars in the world. A soundproof of my car sounds like a library now. <laughs> That's new. Cheap. Maybe it was a cheap, yeah. Smoking. Oh, you, you can hear? Now it's it's a it's a fresh tarmac here, and it's dead silence, well, except for the cars driving by. That's nice. Oh, that's so nice. I have to film in a second. Sixty-seven percent. I have to film. Oh God damn it! Ooh, it takes so long for me to start filming. Check. Hello, hello works. And how bright is it? Way too bright. Oh, I'm driving off. I'm dying. It's okay. Let's film. I'm at 67%. We did 103 kilometers, which would mean 309, but my range is only 192, the car says. So this together would mean 100 and no, now it's 104. So, so 100, uh, 295 kilometers, so we'll see. Consumption is still at 187. Average speed goes up to 89, that's amazing. Ooh, Tesla Model 3 in white. Woohoo, passing me because I'm a slowpoke and he has a great car. He has had special 
blue headlights. Uh, so so real lights. Huh. Interesting. I did my video. Yeah, it was good. Oh my god. You guys are way too fast with the commenting. If I'm not here for a second, I think it's the invoke feature and cactus. <laughs> Hello from Norway and Bo. Ugliest car is the new BMW 4 series just because of the, the, the front. I have to see it for myself. I, I saw at the Frankfurt Motor Show uh, uh, an i4, I think, and it was not looking good. My range is bigger than yours. <laughs> Hi, Jill. Darren again there. Yay! Of course, they had elbow. Look better and for vehicle and even in this case where differences are tiny. Tesla Bjorn? Where's Tesla Bjorn? Is he here? No. Darren, did you just pass Chris? Yes. All the rich yummy mummies drive evokes passed you like a ninja. Yes, he did. I oh, you mean it was Tesla when you just passed me? Yeah, but it was a German license plate. I did go by then just because I can. You drove all the way from Manchester here just to pass me, give me the finger and go on. We have also ID3 for two months, but it works good. Shout out from Norway. That's good. I saw BMW Series 4 in real and it was less ugly than I thought. I recommend buying a Tesla in a country with only two 50 kilowatt chargers and a few AC fast chargers. P.S. All my commutes are less than 250 kilometers. Um, you don't have superchargers as well? Well, I have to calculate a bit. You, you have to take your worst case, what you will drive, but Model 3 with the range, it should, it should work. I would give you two fingers because you're special. Thank you. <laughs> Agree, Jill. <laughs> nope, Tesla is not official. Not officially here. Ha! Huh. Where are you? That would be interesting to know. He's in Portugal. Portugal has no supercharges. I doubt that. You don't have Ionity, but you should have superchargers, right? Watchers. Ooh, sun a bit. By the way, my car is offline for the last week. I don't know why. It just... After driving, it was just gone. Not off the online anymore, so I cannot use the app on this car. Ooh, a key. Here yeah, Enero, or maybe a, a plug-in hybrid. No, I think it's an Enero passing me too. <laughs> All electric cars are passing me. I'm too slow. <laughs> we buy the Teslas from Dubai. Showroom and the support and honor, we warranty and everything. Oh, yeah, that's sad. I think it's better than Model 3, isn't it? it in my opinion, but other will... Uh, it, it's, it's all about your opinion. You have to try both. I love the drive of the ID3 more than the Model 3. But charging range power is 10 times better in Model 3. And if Model 3, you always have to get the long range. Standard range plus is just crap. And Derry knows it. <laughs> Would you recommend to buy a Hyundai Matrix? Of course, found a cheap one in Romania. <laughs> so, so the one who's asking about the, I haven't seen it yet. Uh, Oman, this is where you are. I don't even know where that is. I'm so sorry. Where is Oman? So next, next to, to, to Saudi Arabia or whatever. I have no idea. I'm not familiar with that area. I apologize. And geographically, I, I suck anyways. We're at 64%. 9% to go. Consumption is higher at 189. 
Did your problems with the ID3204 battery drain got fixed? No, it did not. I didn't have an empty battery since then, but I, I drive it almost every day. I'm, I'm, I'm using it to go to work. But I have other problems. <laughs> that the voltage is crushing. I think that my 12 volt battery is broken. I have a workshop appointment this Monday. Again, the next one, Mr. What's your name? Beat Meyer. The 90 kilometers on the highway has nothing to do that you should drive on the highway with 90 kilometers. 90 kilometers an hour, I say now the third time, um, is the simulation of a normal use of a car. City, country, a bit of highway, and you cannot simulate this in the city because every city is different you stand in front of a light blah 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 and so to driving a constant speed at 90 which in a lot of european countries is not far away from the top speed they're allowed to drive then you get a consumption average consumption what your normal daily driving would be i will do the same test with 130 which is just highway in a few european countries i said it again Next time you guys have to say it if somebody says that. I shave my chest for chill. <laughs> Chris doesn't even know the language in Belgium. No, he doesn't. He's stupid. Good morning, Chris. Yesterday on the infotainment screen, I got a little blue square with a number. Cool. One in it. It was next to the Wi-Fi symbol. You have a Wi-Fi symbol? I don't have a Wi-Fi symbol. I only have a connection, you know, a mobile connection. I'm always amazed people complaining they don't reach W2P after buying an EV. Yeah, that's amazing. Uh, uh, in the first movers uh, uh, club group on the Facebook, uh, I would say 15, 20 posts where people are posting a picture of their range when the battery is full and they're complaining that it doesn't say 420 kilometers. That's amazing. Oh, God. Did they fix the software issues with ID3? It will be uh, all will be fixed with the final software that will come in mid December to January. I'm thinking about getting one, but might instead get Kona if they can't fix out soon. Just wait a bit, see when the new software is on there, then we know for sure, and then you can decide. But drive both, and you will wait for the ID3. I promise you. Is Volkswagen coming through with software update for missing features anytime soon? Again, <laughs> mid-December to January. What's the current battery percentage? 63%. Suggested new camera uh, uh, channel name. Battery life driving 90 kilometers for test purposes only. <laughs> yeah, insane. You'd think people would make some research before buying. No. Will the ID3 make it to the end? No, it will not. Thank you, Darren, for your five pound uh, donation. I'm rich now. Where's rich, by the way? Chill, people buy self charging hybrids. That's true. <laughs> yeah, 62% now, another 7%, and then I turn around. So at 56, I will put in the navigation, and then we'll see where we turn around. I don't want to go too low. Come on, everybody. Come on, join in. Hell yeah. That's the stuff, huh? <laughs> what? I have no idea what this is. <laughs> oh my god. I'm sure Jill just recorded that and put it as an emoji. Ice car almost consumed WDP figure.
because yeah. <laughs> You need a Zoom session, not a YouTube live. <laughs> Busy now. A lot of cars. Oh god. What are you saying? We have ID3 experienced 1D mode to reverse mode didn't work for 15 minutes. But afterwards it worked, also the infotainment system didn't. Yeah, that ha happens right now. You have a beta software. Nothing better than a copyright free music channel. That's true. My travel vlog next year will be in a bathrobe. It has to be. It has to be a blue one. Should I send you mine? How much do you pay for charging at Ionity? Right now I don't pay anything because I have 2,000 kilowatt hours free and I'm, I think I'm very close to 1,000 kilowatt hours now in two months. Um, but if I wouldn't have, if, if those free things are gone, I will pay 10 euros a month and then pay 30 cent per kilowatt hour because I will use it. Because if you, if you charge once full, you're already cheaper with having a monthly plan and this will happen, I'm pretty sure. Can you send me a high resolution pic of your channel ID? I want to make a t-shirt. <laughs> I have. So which do you mean? The, the, the battery symbol with the BL or the, the, the background of the YouTube channel page? But both I have big. You can have it. I send it to you. Sixty-one percent. Where are we? Consumption is now 187. We drove 123 kilometers. Yes, I send you that. Remind me again. I will. F I always forget. Is the sound system good enough? There is no Harman Kardon option for the ID3. <coughs> I love the sound system. Maybe the wrong person. So, I, I am an audio engineer, so I, I, I learned to mix and record bands and stuff. I was never really good at it. <laughs> you can listen to my band's albums, they were good because I, I, it took a long time and I took a lot of time to, to do all this and I had time for it. But as an audio engineer, you want very neutral sound. I don't want an extreme bass and I want, don't want extreme highs and that's what I like. Are very the bass is there I can feel it it sounds good but it's not like crazy by the way I shaved for you guys yesterday um, and for tomorrow important video and 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 therefore I love the sound very well in here it's it's very neutral the highs are a bit too much but I turned them down and the bass I turned up a tiny 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 bit uh, yes I like it Better symbol with the BL. You were a second away from saying you like that, huh? Just like you know who. I don't know what you mean. Sorry. Once they lift up the lockdown, I'm off to Dublin, so we'll test ionity charging. Chris, would 50% to 0% give you less range and 100% to 50 due to increased heat loss at lower state of charge? I have no idea. <laughs> we'll see. I mean, we will see how many kilometers we drove from 100 to 50 percent, and then we'll see how it is from 50 to 5 or so. Darren, are you already making money with your channel? <laughs> Let me know, and I'll try to meet to meet up. Cute. Not with nine subscribers. The two left me alone. No. So 20 percent of your subscribers left. Oh my God! I knew something was different. You look fancy. My chat came up twice okay you're wearing a t-shirt is it your birthday <laughs> wearing a shirt yeah no my, my wife got me this shirt it's a lululemon shirt they normally make uh, yoga pants and stuff like this and she's a big fan of lululemon and they they had this shirt and it looks great oh, my duct tape is not working so well right now it's okay 
Where am I? I'm still subscribed too, Darren. I don't know, Mickey doesn't tell me. I'm there at Christoph Christmas anyway, I'm sure I am. Ah, is it useful to have a wall box for charge at home? It all depends how much range you have to put in every day. And do you have a normal socket? So for me, I thought I should get an 11 kilowatt charger. Then I decided against it because it would have been a thousand euros or more. Then I thought, okay, Germany is giving me 900 euros if I do it. But now I'm still not sure because I want to reduce charging at home. So, and preheating is fine with the normal charger. Charging it from from 70 to 100 percent, even from 60 to 100 percent, from when I come home from work till I go uh, to work the next day. That's how much is it? Four, twelve. It's 14 hours. I arrive at 3 p.m. and I go to work at 6.30. No, it's more. 15 and a half hours. 15 and a half hours of charging with 2.2 .2 kilowatt is... 31... 34 kilowatt hours. And 34 kilowatt hours is almost 60% 60, 60 with heat loss. Let's say 50% of the battery that I can charge overnight. In other countries, Max have subwoofer, but here in Norway, it doesn't have. Why? I thought that, uh, that Volkswagen changed it and no Max has a sub subwoofer. Chris, I thought about it the other day. You should start a winter bathrobe shop. <laughs> Merch! Maybe you could ask Björn advice about his pant shop. That's true. Good morning. How far from your home is the nearest 100 plus kilowatt charger? Uh, you don't want to know because it's so so near. I think it's 10 kilometers, but I don't use it because it costs money. I charge uh, at Aldi grocery store because it's for free, um, and I go grocery shopping too. So that's what I do. And in in half an hour, I can charge from. I posted it the other day. I can't remember what it was. Bjorn has a bath reaches the ground. <laughs> so we've been driving for two hours now, so roughly 108 kilometers. How much range do you have left according to the dashboard? I drove an hour and 28 minutes, 131 kilometers, and I have 166 left. Three chargers are always occupied around here. They're here, here there are two. But the, the grocery store opens up at 7 a.m. and nobody's there at 7 a.m. So for me, that's good. Our local Ollie doesn't have a charger. I'm so sorry. Mine one has. Well, it's not local. It's the one in Posta where I work. Do you have a heat pump? Nope. Not bad at all. I agree. Good sound is not just donk donk. It's true. I have plus 100 kilowatt fastnet chargers. Two kilometers from home, but still no EV. Yeah, that's. I'm a cheapskate, that's true. I just noticed that in, in October, so when I got the ID3, I was charging so much at home and with the Mini and with the Leaf, I charged 450 kilowatt hours in a month. And that's a lot of money and that's why I thought, no, I should charge more where it's free. And on Tuesday and Friday, um, my wife doesn't work and I can go to the grocery store, charge for half an hour and then go to work. And, and so it's an hour of charging, that's 50 kilowatt hours, that's all I need for that week. That's almost full of a battery. And for me, that's 15 euros that I save every week. I just have to do it. Sometimes I'm just lazy or I have to go to work earlier. Do you buy things at Aldi when you charge? Yes, I, I buy my lunch and everything, but I would do that anyways. So it's not that I lose money then. I would just go on a different time. I used it all the little free chargers. I'm a cheapskate too. It's true. My nearest 150 kilometer charge is 500 kilometers away, and we have five or six locations in my town in Norway. Ugh. No problem with the 12 volt block anymore. No, nope, there's still problems. It's still not fixed. Moin Chris, any tips on using the heater? Use it however you want to, and if you need more range, turn it down or turn it off. <laughs> See, I take hand charging almost daily at Aldi. That's a cheapskate. <laughs> That's true. 
And the worst thing is that that, that Taycan get free charging for three years at Ionity. Ooh, I mean, I have free charging also, but he, I have a limit on my free charging. He doesn't. He can charge whatever he wants to. Is the ID3 lose range overnight? I think one or two kilometers, if even. And this is just because of charging a 12 volt battery or preheating or something. Well, where are we, by the way? 56%. I have to get to my navigation and navigate to the other charger. Search. Do now. Tall. No, not Ost. I want West. Where's the other one? Doesn't show me Donut Hall West now. What is it? Do I have to look on the map? Oh, hate that. Yeah, we don't have internet. It's hard to do. There we are. Where's my Ionity? It should be here. That's nice. Okay, 145 kilometers home, and I have 161 range. That's 16 kilometers of range margin. Let's look at our battery, 56%. Yeah, we take the exit in four kilometers. That should be fine. Oh, you say too much right now, I'm concentrated. Sorry. Ooh, only 15 kilometers margin. <laughs> what is it? Consumption is 186. Our average speed is 89. That's just perfect. In three kilometers, I get out of the highway and turn around. And it should be a perfect turnaround point. Where is the turnaround point? What ex Say. Doesn't say what the exit is. We'll see. Oh god, you say way too much here. <laughs> Erding. I don't think I get to Erding. Where are we now? Oh, are we already in Erding? I have no idea. I have to get off the highway right now. Heading. Yeah, the prediction was really good. The airport will be the next exit then. 1400 meters we go off. Is there Stefan here? Ah, Stefan Hogg. Different one. No, it is the, the, the airport exit. All fine. This is where I turned around, I think, with the Hyundai Ionic, the, the facelift with a bigger battery. Let's use some region and turn around. Darren is going? What's going on? Making his own videos, his own live stream? Stealing my people? <laughs> Go ahead, Darren, it's fine. I think we turn around with the, the Ionic here. In the summer. So yes. Consumption is great in the Ionic, but range is not. But this is winter range. That's sunny. I 
isn't it nice how quiet this car is? It's just so much fun. One and a half degrees it says. Let's accelerate. Resume our 93. There we have it, we're back. Any tips charging ID3? How many percent you will have to wait in charging the car? I don't know what you mean. My tip is if you want high charging speed, arrive under 10%. If you dare, I do dare, it's up to you. Because 100 kilowatt only appears. Um, you only have 100 kilowatt to around 30%. 54%, this is where we turned around. That's perfect. I will make a tiny little video about the turning around part. There we are. I just turn around and I put in the navigation the destination. So I have 17 kilometers of march engine. So I'm navigating to the to the charger on the other side of the highway, so not the one that I started, but it's the same elevation, so consumption should be good. I'm at, f f it was at 54%, I looked how to, where to turn around at 56, and those are the stats right now. I would have the heat cranked more, it's at 22 and a half, and the fan is there, but the sun is just, very sh nice shining into the cabin here and warms me up so it it would be higher consumption would be higher and and uh, the range would be less but I will contact you with 50% let's keep it on okay we are at 50% Yeah, I heard that Kia and Hyundai do not give better prices for Ionity. Is the Mr. Mach E coming to Europe? It is, but I don't know when. Ford always tells me they don't have anyone to get uh, to get a Mach E to test out. Did you ask anything for Santa Claus this year, Chris? I already got it. A drone? That's all I need. <laughs> yeah, now uh, next move reported yesterday that, that Kia and Hyundai uh, owners still have to pay 77 cents at Ionity, so they won't charge software update December, January. But I thought you hate Christmas, Chris. I hate the all overall Christmas, yes. It's a stupid thing that it's busy everywhere, and uh, but it's better this year. Any plans with drone? I haven't even flown it once so far. I was busy at work and when I come home it's always dark and I can't do it while work. I wanted to do it today but now I'm filming this. Maybe I do it when the car here is charging because I'm guessing it will take over an hour to charge the car to 100%. I have the drone with me so maybe I try it out beside the, the highway gas station. There's a big field. Maybe I try it there and see how that is. I've never flown a drone, so I want to start slow and see how that is. Yeah, it's true. Scratch, I scratched uh, the ID3 with it, that's the plan. What model is the drone? It's a DJI Mini 2. Uh, so it's under 250 grams and then in Germany I don't have to put a sticker on it who it belongs to. I don't need to do anything. I can just fly. I mean the same rules. I cannot fly above people and uh, where there's an airport or something like this. Any piano black on a drone? No, it's all plasticky, matte, gray, light gray. 
And we're going into the fog again. And that means it will get cold. Yeah, I feel it instantly. Come in here and it feels colder. I have 18 kilometers of margin. So it's the way back seems like it's less consumption than the way here. Chris, in France at Ionity, there are multi chargers at 50 kilowatt Chatamo CCS and CCS combo. What's the diff? What's CCS and CCS combo? Oh, there was a, a, a Kona Electric just passed me. He was also like, what the hell? Why is he driving so slow? Joan? Charging an EV must be cheaper than refueling a diesel car. Well, uh, for me, it, it's not about that. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm honest. I'm okay if it costs me, and it costs me more to drive this ID3 than my Hyundai Matrix that I owned before. I'm okay with that. It, it, I'm paying for the comfortability and the quietness and the adventures I have with it, and I'm okay with it. In Norway, you can buy a drone, but you can hardly use it anywhere. You should paint your drone in piano black. That's true. Uh, good news in France. Total and total announced they will take over all corridor charging points, which closed and open new ones. That's great. When? ACDC. If you use charge, charge point, you are charged 33 cent per kilowatt hours. There is no CCS AC. There shouldn't be. If then type two. Greetings from Finland. Just ordered my ID4. Should arrive February, March. Excited. Let's see what winter range is in Finnish temperatures are like. Well, when you get it in March, hopefully winter is over. So hopefully friends will get a good fast charging network one day. Yeah, that would be nice. I mean, Ionity, there are more. The, the, France is, is, is getting more and more Ionity chargers. Not the way that I want to go. There's still one missing from fr Paris to can can I don't know C A E N can I don't know and you will never be able to say it and I'm sorry I'm not French are there still any decent independent energy tariffs in Germany no nope. the because the only decent C charging is um, ENBW 39 cent per kilowatt hours but they don't support Ionity anymore. So we charge is the way to go right now. March in Finland is still winter. I'm sorry. Can first try was great. No, no, it's it's C A E N. It's the one at the Normandy coast. My wife and I want to go when it's stupid Corona at some point is over. How you said it the last time was correct. What was the last time? Huh? <laughs> God. Damn. Yeah, still a long time for friends, even on it is weak. Mm. Yeah, but it's more and more. And Spain gets millions of Ionity and Portugal has none. I'm so sorry to Marcus. But he he doesn't seem like he wants to do very long trips. I, I'm guessing he does his weekly trips to the... Uh, good morning, Chris and friends. Yeah, that's what this is. Uh, um, I think Marcus just wants to go to the beach and back. 50% oh I have to film music off sound works hello yes there we go I'm at 50% look at that let's look at our stats 155 kilometers that would mean 310 kilometers at zero I won't drive it to zero average consumption is going down I think the consumption on the way back is a bit lower Heat is still at 22 and a half degrees. Again, sun is helping. Um, I have 19 kilometers of margin. I see that margin is going up a bit too. Uh, so that's good. So it's it's not as stressful to get back. But as always, you know that from all my other range tests, um, almost at the end there's an uphill part where for 15 kilometers it goes slightly uphill but then the last six seven kilometers it's totally downhill so that's cool I'm looking forward to that and then we charge we did 50% that's good 
Ooh, RS6 or RS4. Power. Oh, what did someone say? I didn't see it. That's okay, better life. But if you want immobility everywhere, there must be a cost gap for juice. Of course. No, no. I, 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 I would. Of course, that the charging should be easy and not expensive. But I also can understand Ionity that if they put a, a, a million euro charger there, you just cannot give the juice away for free. Then you have to charge somewhere else. But who else is building chargers on the highway? And I want to teach just amazing for that. Was away for a few minutes, just catching up. Good meet up. I'm on the north. But I want to teach somewhere could be cool. Yes, you must read the Norwegian rules for drones. Oh my God, millions of Ionity is a bit of an overstatement for Spain. I think like 20. We are way behind most countries, but it seems that they are beginning to build stations finally. Yes. When it will be possible to use Tesla superchargers if Elon Musk allows it, but I doubt that he will do it because then he has to increase the numbers of stalls too. And then will, that will cause a lot of Tesla drivers to be mad. And I understand that. They paid for it somehow. Thankfully, the alternative where do you say in EU to Ionity? That's true. Where did you see the news about Total? Tesla fanboys will cry and puke that happens, so forget it. I think so too. Netherlands, they are more Fastnet. Yeah, Fastnet is cool in, in, in the Netherlands. In Germany, they are not a lot. But what I love about Fastnet the most is that they have a roof. I love that. I heard in YouTube channel I'm watching in French. Huh? Huh? Way too warm in here. And I went on 22 degrees. Yeah, that sun is not helping. No faster in Austria. Really? We have a few. I think like four or five in Germany. Wilfer, we have first mover club for ID4. I, I don't know. I, I honestly. I always thought that the first mover club was for the ID3 because the new the software is not done and I wanted to find out what they have to fix and what people like or don't like. Not with the next update, I'm pretty sure that was done, just, just made uh, to work then. But for the next update, I thought this would be the thing. And I think the ID4 will have to finish software that the ID3 is having too. I mean, have you seen the, the video where, where Herbert Diest, the, the CEO of Volkswagen, is driving with uh, the e-mobility chef of Volkswagen, what's his name? Uh, Ulbrich, uh, they're driving in an ID4 and they already have the augmented the head-up display part. So they have the final software already in there. Ionity is not the biggest here at, uh, at least. Yeah. Yeah, in Germany, uh, Ionity is just the best on the highway. Other countries I cannot speak about. I don't know. 20 kilometers of margin now. It really gets more. My consumption is slowly going down. 185 right now. It's a good song, too. Outside temperature at the moment is 2.5 degrees. Like I said, the sun the sun is helping a lot. Without that, I would have to heat to 24 degrees. Yeah, with the temperature in the wind for a winter test, it's always hard. Of course, there are countries and parts of countries that are way colder, but there are also countries where in the winter it's way warmer. And I just used the, the first day where it was minus four during the night, and I knew that it would not get warmer than five degrees today, and I thought I'd do that. Hello, VCB. <laughs> Going now for a while, I'll catch up with you later. Stay safe, kids. 
So you're working? <laughs> I heard subsidies in Germany will continue after 2021. Yes, the, the 6,000 euro will, they're talking about it to, to 2025 or something. I think so. Stay safe, take care Marty. 15 fast stations in, in Germany. Oh, that was wrong, sorry. In my region there's one. Have you tried Fastnet Auto Charge? Pretty cool. No, I have not. What does it do? Curious to hear later news about Marty Gate. And yeah, go to north of Germany. Yeah, there are more there. Then. Like we are driving by one here in Pilsen, uh, very close to the BMW factory. If there's enough money left, we'll see. <laughs> As Would be nice if in three years they still have, or now two years and a bit, they still have the incentives that if I buy another EV in a few years. <laughs> no more charging cards or apps needed. It will detect your car via CCS protocol, similar like Tesla. So plug and charge. That's cool, but the car has to has to support that too. I don't know if the I, I'm pretty sure the ID3 cannot do that right now, but maybe at some point. And I hope that Ionity will be able to do that too. So just plugging it in and done. Almost any does since it's implemented in CCS. Okay. If you know more, I don't know. Travel Assist is like autopilot. Tesla. I don't have Travel Assist. I have never tested it. I drove a Max, but in the city without the travel assist, so I couldn't say. And I'm not the biggest fan of autopilot features. Only for me as a content creator, if I film something and I want the car to stay in the middle, that would be the only time where I need travel assist. When I'm driving, I prefer steering myself. I want the adaptive cruise control though, that's, that's nice. Each one doesn't, I think, but eGolf and Adri does, does it, I'm pretty sure. It's not yet implemented in the ID3. It will be implemented sometime in the future, but until the plug and charge is not an option. So everybody has a different opinion now. Chill only for Paris won't help for auto routes. Travel assist works quite well, the opposite of lane keep assist. Well, another Tesla. Well, lane keep is just a safety thing, so you cannot say that this is something to drive. No news about corridor or any investment in fast charging along French highways. I don't know, I don't know, it's ID4. What I think of the ID4, I don't want an, an SUE, it's not my thing. I like that it comes in all wheel drive at some point and with the big battery. Did you watch Tesla full self driving videos? No, <laughs> except, except for that reason. Until this is not a demo and not a, a, a beta version, if you really get into the car and tell it, and then it's boring. I mean, think about it. You get into the car, and y yes, for a daily commute, I can see that, that this is interesting. You just tell it to, uh, to work, but and then you have breakfast or whatever in the car, the half an hour where you need it. See the battery status here in my action camera. What does it say? Is it eight? What good? Doesn't need any battery at all. I'm at 44%. Have 18 kilometers of margin. I thought it was ah, I was uphill here. Maybe because this it went down. Consumption is 186 now, but here in Lanshut it goes really a tiny bit uphill. Lane keepers in next year about keeping in the center of the lane when you are 100% in the center. Yeah, it's true, it's crap. How many ID3s have you seen around Posa? Two white ones and the, the one at my dealer. He has two black ones and a white one in the in the showroom. But on the road twice, on the same day even, when I went to go for home from work on a Friday, I saw two white ones coming. In the other from the other direction 
but I turn lane keeper sit off every time I get into the car. I'm not driving with this. I'm sure there will be face lift. The piano finish crap must be eliminated. Torture to designers. Can't wait for the piano black trend to die. Yeah, but face lift for the ID3 will be a while. It's just coming out right now. I mean, we're talking about two years or so. Then there's face lift. Now at 19 kilometers of margin. It's really warm in here with the sun. I can put it to 21 degrees now. Only saw one ID3 around, but I'm driving this lately. Yeah, understandable. But since I saw, I've seen those two except from from the, the the cars that my dealer has to to give test rides i haven't seen any since then i'm starting to like piano black it's a little dirty but i'm starting to like it you like it dirty in ego huh don't you <laughs> Bjorn is live. <laughs> what is he doing? What is Bjorn doing? Will we drink drive with level 4 or 5 autonomy? Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, that would be amazing. At some point there will be no drunk driving since you're not driving yourself anymore. But <laughs> okay, Bjorn is live. Bye, Chris. <laughs> it's okay. You can go. <laughs> I understand his live streams are better. Who's Bjorn? No idea who that is. Let's battle it a bit. It's incredible with the gasometer. Every degree of heat that I switch, it's so much. Right now, 20 kilometers of margin. I bring the, the climate one degree down. Well, it's only one kilometer. Before it was more. Let's keep it at 22. Kia Björn or Tesla Björn. Björn is live all the time. I think he spends more time in cars than with wife. I'm pretty sure he does. He's ironing his pants in a live stream. Oslo Stravang in Oslo. Yeah, that's why I wanted to do an interview with him. And he, he, he didn't reply. I wanted to, to, to talk to him just in a normal way. How much time does he spend for YouTube? I mean, it's not just the, the filming and editing, it's researching and contacting um, um, importers and car makers about getting cars and, 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 and uh, have contact with, I'm sure, his patrons and stuff and Facebook and posting, all of this stuff. So it, it, it's a lot and I wanted to know from him how much time a week does he spend on that so 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 does he have days where he says no on Thursday I don't do anything with the channel stuff like this I would have wanted to know that and and it, does he have a close relationship to his patrons or not it would just be stuff and how does he plan drives and the, the live stream how much driving does it do every week seems like a lot all of those questions but he didn't reply and and if he has a, a goal so does he have anxiety uh, I should ping him again does he have anxiety about YouTube because he's living off of YouTube so if he doesn't make money he doesn't get money I mean he has his patreon support that's good but YouTube in income has to come. So how was it when you were stuck in Thailand? Oh, another white, white Tesla Model 3. Is it the same as before? I think it's the No, it's all the thing. Oh, the, or what's the A, Darmstadt? <laughs> Darren again. Bjorn gets upset every time something asks him about the kind of stuff. Or so. Huh. So he's very private, and I understand that. That's why I wanted to do it. Oh, not an EQC! Look at that! What's going on today? This is the car I will be getting in March. 
an EQC. Why is he passing? Look at them, the truck is passing a different car. For a long trip, at when, what temp, battery status of battery, can you say it's time to look for charger around with ID3 58 kilowatt? That all depends how you're driving and the weather. You can't say it and where the chargers are. It's just, you can't say it like that. Sorry, it's, a, it's not possible. Um, I, if you have hyperchargers, <laughs> if you have hyperchargers and uh, you arrive under 10%, you get the best charging speed. That's what I can say. Bjorn is driving ice today. Ugh. I look younger without beard. I have beard. I just shaved this side part here and underneath. And I did it many times. For most of my videos, I do that. But I got it a bit lazy, I have to say. With shaving, you still look younger. Thank you. <laughs> or is this an insult? <laughs> yeah, I have to pass this truck. I'm doing 92. And I'm, I'm, I'm drafting behind him. That's also not good. But there are cars coming from the back. I have to... 91 now. Oh my god. You have to pass him with a hundred. Okay, accelerating. Driving a hundred. Oh, it's always stressful. Car is coming in the back, but he's coming slow. That's okay. Like 12. Yes, I am 12. In the interview, you might be able to see mine. I will be in Hamburg then. <laughs> Have you had chance of test driving a new BMW iX3? The car is supposed to be pretty good. Well, it all depends what good is for you. It charges pretty fast, consumption will be high, and it's an SUV. It's this car here in front, just an electric, a new version. And it's not from ground up a new electric car. They just took an, an i3 and put a battery in it. So I'm not that impressed. I asked BMW for i4 and an iX3. They didn't reply. They don't care. By the way, what are you testing today? You're so funny, Jill. Stupid journalist. By the way, Swiss journalist did a documentary about the truth about EV. Guess conclusion. <laughs> they are horrible. You made passing the truck like you were breaking the sound barrier. I know. Extremely fast, eh? You were scared there for for me. I have 22 kilometers of margin. It's all cool. My consumption is now at 183, but the heat is back to 23 degrees because the sun is blocked. I prefer that more. I want to have the heat on like I usually do. But I mo you also have to think uh, most of the time, so half of my driving is extremely early where it's dark and cold because I go to work at 6.30 and I'm at work at 7 a.m. So I need more... What's an EQ3? EQC! So E, Q and C... No, I never said that. <laughs> um, EQC is the, the electric car from, from Mercedes. An EQC 400. No, he won't. He want to mines in Africa, in Bolivia, and debugging all fake news really positive. Ah, that's good. Yeah, you never know with this stuff, let's be honest. Yes, there are mines that will be nice and clean, and there will be mines that are horrible, where people are getting abused. By the way, that's an ENIAC. So this car here on the left, the white one, Skoda ENIAC, this will be an electric version. Uh, soon and I contacted Skoda and they replied and uh, 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 a guy at Volkswagen Who knows someone at, at Skoda asked me if he should contact someone and he did but I haven't heard anything back Are you satisfied with the steering wheel heating? I oh, Sorry, I was gone for a second. I really barely use it. I may maybe I use it for two minutes in the morning when I get into the car and then that's it. But most of the time I preheat the car 
anyways to 24 degrees. I have scheduled preheating. Woohoo! The truck is going away. So no slowing down for me. That was lucky. So no need. I I I, I don't just don't use it. So it it gets warm, but I mostly don't use it. Yeah, but it explains really well in tell mines in this country's contract with car manufacturers. Yeah, I got a warning that I should take a break because the car notices that I steer around all the place, all the all the way. Wow, that's nice. For two years, traveled around. I have 23 kilometers of margin now, but I crank up the heat to 24 now, and I have 22 kilometers of margin, so it's fine. I keep it at 22, at uh, 24 now. It gets a bit chilly in here without the sun. You said thing, hopefully they translate it in German. Ha <laughs> ha. So it is. It is. Uh, uh, what is Switzerdeutsch? <laughs> is it? Is it? Switzerland dialect. <clears throat> French, Swiss, German. Oh my god. Whew. French, Swiss, sorry. How about a Taycan? Can you get your hands on one? Nope. Porsche said no. I asked them many times. I even contact them again when I had so many more subscribers with the ID3 and with the fuse that increased no they just said no we don't want you did you know a big part of Switzerland speaks French Chris no I did not I know that a, a big part Swed speaks their own language and so mix of weird German stuff that's all I know I was in, in, in Switzerland for two weeks once when I was a kid at a hospital. That's all I know. Oh, it's too warm with 24 degrees. Put it to 23. Being passed by a truck from Poland. That's how it is when you drive 93 on the highway. Oh, sorry, I was gone for a while, huh? Drop out! Totally worth waking up today. <laughs> That's good. I got a PayPal donation, but I, I can only answer emails then in the evening when I'm done. Whoever that was, thank you very much. 20 euros or something. That's generous. Sandwich or highway. <laughs> you're gonna buy with it sandwich or highway on highway no I'm gonna pay whatever I pay with PayPal so nothing special did you buy a drone with patreon money well yes 
since PayPal is transferring money on my bank account and I pay with my bank account? Yes. So you bought my drone, Jill. Hello girls and boys. I hope you all have a wonderful Saturday. I hope you too. God, I can't read the name. Dimer? Don't lose your drone then. <laughs> yeah, it's yours. Yeah. It's the same when, when I talked to Volkswagen. It was fun. And and I, I told him that I get paid from the ID3 Deutschland tour. And then he said, uh, my contact person at Volkswagen, well, we pay him. So I pay for your, for your salary then. And then I said, yes. And then later I thought, well, I bought the ID3 from you. So I paid for it. So I pay myself <laughs> in a way. So drone. Yeah, we have 42 or 41. Uh, uh. Patreons now. I have to look. Where's Patreon? There it is. Oh, come on. Why do I have to log in again? God damn it. This Patreon thing has to pick Ron's fertility. No pressure at all. No. Yeah, that's good to log in while you're driving. Forty-two. Forty-two patrons. Yay! <laughs> it's awesome. Very excited about that. So nice of you. We have way there. <laughs> At hundred patrons, have to do something special too. Not just with ten thousand subscribers, eh? Yeah, Patreon sucks. App, the apps, yeah, especially for 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 creators. By the way, twenty, right? Yeah, twenty. Does that mean no show tomorrow? Who says that? Why is there no show tomorrow? There is a show tomorrow. Don't worry. Tomorrow is heat pump against not heat pump. New measures in Germany here. What? Here, COVID cases since to go down since I got it. Yeah, it was, uh, uh, like I said, in Passau, my area is, is right now the hotspot in Germany. I think 300 something cases are at 100,000 people. It's nice to go every day to work there then. Ooh, busy. Look at that. Yeah, hotspot proud boy. <laughs> I'm not proud of that. Take care at work. Yeah, we, we, we wear masks all the time except when we're on our specific spot where we work and then I'm alone. That's good. But still, I don't want that. I, I have asthma. I don't need something that attacks my lungs. Really not. I feel my throat talking too much. I haven't done a long live stream in a long time. It's good with the microphone, I don't have to scream. Because 
I'm a screamer. And even with Mac, that's what I thought too before my girlfriend got it. That's true. Yeah, it's not sure. You never know. Come on, duct tape. Hold just a bit. Ooh, only 76 people. People are leaving. I'm too boring. That's okay. I can be boring. We drove 204 kilometers and have 101 kilometers of range left. I have 23 kilometers of margin. Looks okay. Range statistic update, please. I am at 33%. 204 kilometers driven, 101 range, uh, average speed 89, that's perfect, average consumption 123, and my exact kilometers are 205, because I, I even reset the trip meter, that's good, I'm proud of myself, I'm at 32% now, 25 I make it. Oh, you are too boring, or I talk too much. No, no, it's just me. You're perfect, Jill. I have a question regarding to battery charging. I will get my first EV soon, and I plan to charge the car mostly at home. I have solar roof and a sepi wall box. I plan to charge mostly in Eco Plus mode. That means the charge only if solar power is available. That means the charging starts and stops often. Will this hurt the battery? Uh, no, I always thought it would hurt the battery. I really did because people always say with every battery when you charge and then discharge, it's bad for the battery. But in an EV, every time when you use regen, you're charging for a second and then you go on every time and, and some some electrician told me that that with EVs you don't have to worry so don't worry about it the only thing is that right now the ID3 if you get that uh, wouldn't work with that because I heard that the ID3 when it only gets 500 watt of charging it stops charging <laughs> that's what I heard I don't know if other cars do that too I don't know why the ID3 does it I get ID4, huh? Well, you have to ask then. I don't know with the ID4 if, if this is a software thing, if it's a bug, or if it's has if there's a reason for it. I just know that a lot of people have complained right now with the ID3 when they charge it with solar panels, and the charging power went under 500 watt, then the car disabled charging, and then you have to enable it by hand. So unplug and plug it back in. It doesn't start automatically. But again, could be a bug. I don't know. Oh my! We just drove by the the, the electric power plant. We missed it. I love this song. Was it so so much clickbait when I said my ID3 died? It has over 80,000 uh, uh, views now, but I can see with the comments that it's mostly people that don't like the ID3 from the start or electric cars. Seventy-two kilometers to go, forty minutes. That means three hours. So in three hours we should arrive with 270 kilometers driven and then I should have uh, uh, should have 20 kilometers more on the decimeter. Yo what's up Mox Mutamon? That's awesome. <laughs> Man you got rich having your car die. It's true. I'm totally honest. 
it was it, there, there was a reason for the ID3 and not Model 3. It it is not just yes, I prefer the driving of the I, of the ID3 to the Model 3 seating position, the steering wheel feel, the noise. It's all true. But also Model 3 is based in California, so I could never have any contact with headquarters with Volkswagen I got in contact, but it wasn't the biggest reason because I had no idea I would get in contact with them. And then with the ID3, because it's new, I thought it would be more interesting for the channel. And then they just released it with a software that wasn't finished at all. And then with the 12 volt battery drain problem, it, it's, it's, it's good content for the channel. It's not amazing for me. I don't need my car to have problems, but it also makes it more interesting. Can I get to 80% before the creepy guy gets here? <laughs> no, he's already here. Creepy guy. I'm the creepy guy. Yeah, no need to have excuses because we know you do it for money. <laughs> it's true. I do it for fame and money. It's the only reason. God, it's a dirty old big car. A wall. Shoot, it's secret. You still, still don't know. <laughs> it's a shovel guy already already waiting at the, the Ionity charger. That's good. Yeah. Huh. 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 So any news about the software update for the ID? I mean, does it really fix all the bugs? We don't know. <laughs> uh, I have never, I have not driven a car with with a, with the final update yet, so I don't know. We'll see. We'll see, we hope. live stream and how was it is it better <laughs> you can go Jill it's okay there was a good morning Steffen as if he doesn't have his chill or really I thought he does so people that, that comment a lot it's a bit sad for him <laughs> I'm sure he does he has people that come over and over again to his live streams his core it's just more people it, it, it's not just two or with, with Marty three how is he so far I don't know what that means how's it going no they are not so awesome than us that's true that's true you guys are way more awesome how does it go so far it's good Driven 217 kilometers and I'm at 28 percent. At 25, I'll make a little video. Denglish rules. That's what I'm doing here the whole time. I'm all Denglish here. Extreme Denglish. Even my wife, who's Canadian, is doing Denglish. How cool is that? Wallersdorf.
brutal verse. <laughs> it's good. It's a good one, brutal verse. Oh god, it's a really good one. Oh. I, I stand for internal combustion engine. Means uh, benzene or the diesel. Why don't you speak in German, Chris? German call in Germany. <laughs> That's true. You're Canadian too. Where are you from? My wife is from Ottawa. Sam here was born in Quebec. I'm so sorry. <laughs> You're French. <laughs> like Jill. We make fun of French here. Especially Jill makes fun of French people. French speaking people. <laughs> And if you get insulted by that, then you're wrong here. We do a lot of sarcasm, cynical stuff. We're all we're all cute. We're all joking around here. Don't get mad! Don't leave! Don't leave me alone! You know, Quebec is French-speaking, but not Switzerland or Belgium. Well, since my wife is from from Canada, and I was in Canada for six months, and we drove to Quebec a few times, I know that Quebec speaks French, yes. <laughs> but I was in Switzerland for two weeks when I was seven, so sorry if I don't know that. I was never in Belgium, I was never in Netherlands, I was in France, so I know that. No, no excuses. <laughs> That's enough. I'm going. Sorry, chill. I'm so sorry. Let's do that. 222 divided by 3 times 4 is 296 kilometers. Let's prepare filming at 25%. Ah! I ripped out breast hair. That hurt. Hello, yes, all works. Twenty-five. We are twenty-five percent, and we have been driving two hundred twenty-three kilometers. That's almost exactly three hundred kilometers for the whole thing. But um, I've only had fifty-nine kilometers to the charger, so at the end we have two hundred eighty-two, and then twenty kilometers, maybe even more left. We'll see. Like I said, there's the uphill. Our average consumption is still at 183. It's still the same after heat at 22 and a half. It's three and a half degrees out there. It gets a bit warmer, and the sun is not directly on me, but it's it's warming up. Live stream is going very well. About 100 people, and Jill is making fun of me as always. Haha, <laughs> mentioned you in the video. Where's Marty and Darren? Can mention you too. They're not here. Marty is working and Darren left because he doesn't like me anymore. And he has his own <laughs> his own live stream going. <laughs> it has to be on the video. You're always famous, Jill. I mean, you're 90% of the live stream comments. Of course you're famous. So, so, so be honest, what are you doing right now? Are you working at home right now on the computer? And then on the side, you list, just listen to uh, what I'm doing here, and then you type, and then go back to work. Two people on Darren live stream. Is Darren really doing a live stream right now? I was joking. I had no idea. Doing a live stream. My sister lives in France, I just don't get into that language. I don't, 
I don't know why. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> don't have to apologize. Toller Kanal hier, immer wieder. Warum in English? Ich hau dir was nicht auf, bro. Oh man, we just made fun of people who are German and complain that I don't do my channel in German. <laughs> I'm watching Baby TV with my son. Oh, I don't work on Saturdays. That's a good idea. He's working at home. Tesla Burn went to Darren channel. <laughs> yeah. I do my videos in English because I get I have more people here, more fun people. Yeah, Germans are not at the tend not to be funny. Look at me. I'm not funny. Not at all. Not even a bit. Amazing. No, okay. Oh, news for you, Chris. What's the news? Give me the news, Jill. He's getting an ID4 tomorrow. <laughs> Getting father for a second time. Congratulations, Jill. You did well. <laughs> your job is done now. It's all to, up to your wife. Why excludes 95% of the world? Exactly. He's right. Andre is totally right. Why just serve a few countries? And it's it's more fun, and there are not too many Germans doing in Germany driving an ID3 doing videos about it. That's why. Thanks. It was difficult, hard to find menu. <laughs> you did well. I'm so proud of you. Oh, it's up to your wife, poor one. Yeah, she's a poor wife. She has to deal with Jill being on live streams all the time. No manual video on that. <laughs> I have to go to work. To work. Others can paint their fence or kitchen while working from home. Yeah, it's true. Computer work. Oh, a nice Porsche. She's working today. <laughs> it's even better. You have said that they often work from home. And your wife is working. Is she home? Is she all have, also have an office job where she's home? It's a good song. Nope. So she's outside in the free world. Librarian, cool. Don't see that many people there right now. Is it connected with the school? All the distance stuff. Yeah. Eight kilometers. Ah, yeah. <laughs> Sorry, that's true. How would you get COVID if you're never outside of the house, eh? No, no news from Stuhl. Haven't I haven't heard anything from him since uh, I drove home with the ID3 when I got it uh, September 11th, where he he said in the in the chat that he's been getting a new car soon. Since then, I haven't heard anything from him. So since that live stream, so for two months, he was never on on. Saturday or the other live streams. No, I don't have the latest software yet. That will come in mid December, end of December, or maybe even January. Tesla will do holiday special update. <laughs> yeah, it's true. Updates for everyone. Yeah, cute. Um, I wanted to say something, now I forgot. What was it? Oh yeah! Um, 
<clears throat> I wanted to know. So, uh, if if you like that, the 91 people who are watching now, or 90, <laughs> I would go down every time. Um, um, I would love to know your ages, the people that are here. Who's the youngest here? Who's the youngest and the oldest who's watching the live stream right now? That would be very interesting. So, I start, I'm, what am I, 43. My wife is 42. Jill is 32, I say. 37, that was close. 57, you're the leading part right now. Jill is the youngest so far. 67, Mark is leading. 32. He's the youngest. Where's 18 year old girl? <laughs> Photostrom, 37. That's good age. 28. There's the youngest. TV Salu. He's the youngest. <laughs> Max Mustermann just laughs. <laughs> no age. So we have. 67 and 28 you don't look a day older <laughs> over 49 Chris thank you that's why I'm not 49 <laughs> go make fun of me that's cute from 28 to 67 it's good age 89 really are you not there yet no that's Darren he must be the oldest he's above 89 that's what the hair said. Ha, ha, ha. He's lying. Need a BMW accelerates. That's my thing. We were talking mental age. Ah. Yeah, then I'm... Oh, God. Mental age, then I'm 92. No. Ah, they'd say 55. I'm 99. Either 99 or 9. Or real age? <laughs> But 28 to 89, if the the, the 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 that one is really true with the 89, and I'm saying that somebody is lying. 99. That was fun. Thank you guys. I still have my 20 kilometers of margin, but I will be going up the hill as always, and then going down. So the margin will go down and then stay that way. Mental age sometimes 16, sometimes 138. <laughs> Darren, we didn't ask your IQ, we said age. <laughs> Are you going to Straubing? Nope! I already turned around, I'm almost there. 25 minutes, I'm back to the charger, I'm at 19%. Still 44 kilometers to go. Björn doesn't have that. Björn doesn't have on his live streams two, two people like Darren. Did Tesla Björn follow you there? <laughs> going off here, going to Posau. No, you are a god, Darren. There's no thinking. Got so many trucks, I will have to pass so many times. Let's pass this one. At hundred. Oh, 
All hail me! We already do. You're amazing. Probably 100% men watching live. No, there was a woman before. There was a woman who said that her man has a BMW and she has an ID3. Her husband, a man. So many drugs in these. Come on, you, you can't listen to this music like this. Turn up the volume. <laughs> we need the ID3 in Canada. It was loud in here. The, the microphone just pointing towards my voice, uh, my, my, my face, so it's not that bad. What's the dreadful noise? That's me speaking. It's amazing lyrics. That's correct. Lady in red, yeah, I'm, I don't think that Christa Berg would like that. Thirty-nine kilometers to go, twenty-two minutes. Uh, Fifty-nine kilometers of range, so twenty kilometers of marching. Totally fine. I can arrive with way under ten percent and hopefully get my hundred kilowatt. We'll see how the charging goes with driving ninety and four and a half degrees right now. That's happy. Happy rock. No Irishing. I'm a woman. Yay! There she is. And she's watching since the beginning. Let's all say hi. That's nice. You must be the only woman. Is there another woman here? I would like to know. Is my wife here? <laughs> Never. Maybe Darren can sing Lady in Red so we don't get copyright issues. Okay, 99%. Uh, hi, Mikey. Chris used to be a woman. <laughs> yeah, it's a bit busy now. Damn it. A lot of cars coming in the back. Passing this truck will be stressful and they're coming fast. long here if that counts <laughs> yeah then it counts with me too oh there's another woman hi that's good my wife is watching as well I guess that counts yeah it does I have long hair too yes somewhere but not on your head maybe on your back or your toes 16% I want to say hi to all the women <laughs> Two to three women that don't have a beard, it counts. <laughs> there was it three or two women of 86 people? That's a good percentage. That's three, four percent. Strike. See, the phone doesn't overheat even though the sun is shining on it because it's cold. <laughs> Five degrees out there right now. Consumption is still the same. Lady Red! Down court there, Phil. Yes. We all watch Chris drive as we can't drive in UK lockdown, so we have to make us <laughs> driving somewhere. <laughs> I'm so sorry. So you're not allowed to drive at all? Oh. Well, this is my job. Even in Germany, if it wouldn't be allowed for work, you can always drive. So I would be allowed to. But tomorrow, the other guy wouldn't. Really forbidden to drive in the UK? It would be horrible. It sounds, sounds disgusting. We can go to the shops and to work, huh? Or doctor. More likes than watches. What happened? They all left. Chris de Berg has magic eyebrow with healing powers. <laughs> oh, 
Like on friends. Yeah, let's like if you're friends. That was Hangers Berg. Come on. My duct tape always gets loose that holds the cable for the microphone. Mike, what are you doing in France? Get out of there, man. <laughs> My last ribbon this year so small. Oh. Can I understand that, yeah. Well, I have... Ooh, exactly 250 kilometers, by the way. Why do I have two reports? I have an alert and please charge vehicle. That's not an alert for me. Uh, total distance covered 8,700 kilometers so far. Yikes. So that's what I should drive in six months and not in two. But it will get. I, I already noticed that it gets less and less that I drive. So except for work, I mean, at some point all the consumption tests are done. I will not do a thousand kilometer test again. Stuff like this. We should start vaccinating in two weeks if all goes well. Cool. Why should he get away? <laughs> Darren, at 99, you are first in line for vaccines. <laughs> I drove 34 miles in my EV just to buy some one-pound sausage rolls for my child to take to school. I'll be behind you in the queue. <laughs> oh, God. Is it already through that the vaccine works? Do we know that? Yet. No need for vaccine, Darren. Immune. Are we sure about that? <laughs> well, it will be the same system as with the vaccine. So now we're getting a bit uphill, that's why my margin is going down. That's okay. Fourteen percent, twenty nine to go. It's ninety five percent effective, just awaiting approval. Yeah, okay. You're too Irish? Trump is racing, he can credit for the vaccine. <laughs> That's true. That would be amazing. I invented it. Not some guy, it was just me. <laughs> what phone are you using to stream from? I have the Xiaomi Mi 9T Pro. I have to pass him right away. He's not driving 90. Oh, but there's a car coming in the back. No, I can't pass. Damn it, I have to slow down. Oh, so many cars coming. I'm driving 77, but after that BMW, I can go by. Well, of course, I'm a cheapskate. I buy the stuff that does the job and doesn't cost too much. A, a phone that has a, a plug so I can plug in a microphone for live streaming. It's rare to find these days. Samsung doesn't have that anymore. And I don't want a Bluetooth mic. I don't even know if that works. 
<laughs> no, I had the Xiaomi before Patreon. <laughs> oh, I think so. I can't remember. But we were on the Patreon back then. After Xiaomi for almost half a year or so. Any gift for this year? <laughs> Watching a action camera a bit. I have 15 kilometers of margin and 14 minutes to go, 24 kilometers. I give the gift of me, and that's enough. You're amazing, Darren. Your wife is very lucky. <laughs> Not joking. Twelve percent for twenty-four kilometers. That should be okay. But it's uphill. That's why my margin is going down. Pixel phone in the new Chromecast. Totally worth it. But still no Christmas gift. Huh. I thought about the Pixel phone too, but again. The, no no but the, the 4 thing has still, Pixel 4 has still a microphone connection. Chris is such a boss. When he was born, he named his parents. <laughs> it's a good one. It's a real good one. It's the boss. Eleven percent. I get tools for Christmas. Yeah, so you can do something. I have a 4A and have a mic connection. Yeah, the 4. I looked at the 4A, but again, it was what was it? 500 euros. I thought about it. I know the camera is better, but what I'm. Yeah, I just. Yeah. I didn't know tools. The band. It's just tool, not tools. Oh good, that's good. Same price as this one here. To repair broken Volkswagen. Yeah, that's his thing. No, he will install million, millions of Model 3s with the automatic opening of the trunk and the hood. Be the boss when it comes to that. Amazing. God, I'm slimy today, huh? Way too nice. Alright, so a lot of trucks. How the hell should I get by those? And a lot of people behind me. Oh my. I'm never getting by those cars. Trucks. Did they solve your 12 volt battery drain issue? No, they did not. It should be solved with the final update, the final software. But I don't know for sure until. I see it. Oh, I'll pass one or two trucks uphill. That's nice. uphill we're going in, in here Ooh, and the truck is passing in the front I love the beginning of the song hit the like for Chris <laughs> oh thank you just like me you don't have to hit it <laughs> Pass again. Another few. Ooh, we are 10%. I get a warning. But the people that know me know that this happens a lot. Someone 
the first coming. Yeah, I'm driving a hundred for the last minute. That's annoying with the 200 trucks here. Hit Chris for likes, that's true. Only 10 kilometers of margin, 9%. Yeah, to slow down. So maybe this this having to speed up here uh, eliminates that the sun was out and I had could drive uh, with less heat power. Wearing my dressing gown. Last truck, we did it. We passed like 20 trucks. And we did it. Let's slow down to our 93. Oh. What type of metal is this? <laughs> Free metal. <laughs> Hello, yes, sound works. Yeah, I'm at nine percent. You know, that's my hill. Um, driven 268 kilometers, 14 to go, so it will be 282, and then we have 10 kilometers range left, I guess, something like this. So then 292, that's the one I, I, I calculated. Oh my god, it would be amazing. A ray, uh, it got, I just had to pass, I don't know, 10 trucks or so with 100 kilometers. So of course my consumption went up and it was uphill too. But I think this was good because my heat consumption was less since, I, since the sun is shining in my face the whole time. So if there wouldn't be any sun, I would have to heat on 24 the whole time, more consumption, and then, so I think this, this driving 100 for, I don't know, three minutes and uphill worked in the favor of getting a better result. But I don't think it will be 300 kilometers at the end. We'll see. It's now only one or two kilometers uphill and then downhill to the end. 8%, all red, all fine. Chill out, I say. We've driven three hours. Our average speed is pretty good with 89. I like that. Ooh. And the temperature changes. It was five degrees. Uh, uh, now it's three degrees. All depends where it is. I'm always wearing the same shoes. I have, I have a summer shoe, Adidas something. Then I have. Uh, fall and uh, uh, spring shoe which is a Nike a bit warmer and then I have I use this shoe also in the winter except when I have to walk in the snow then I have a different shoe can you see power usage for climate no I can see power use overall and right now because it's uphill it's 26 34 28 26 Bath drops for the win, yes. But I cannot see how much the heat is taking. I'm guessing when the car is standing, it says two, three, but it says kilowatt hours per hundred kilometer when I'm standing, that's wrong. And I think it's just the wrong display. It would be two or three kilowatt for, for heating. Till, since it's not a, um, a heat pump, that makes sense. 10 kilometers to go, 7%, 19 kilometers of range. Consumption went up to 187, but now it's downhill just a few hundred meters. You need, need, need I guess, a heater. <laughs> it's good. Red dance shoes on Saturdays, yes. 
I can show you when we are at the Georgia. Um, and, and just for the plan, um, when I don't know, I think when I'm charging, uh, I will stop the stream because I will get out of the car. Maybe if I have time, um, to test the drone if I want to. We'll see how long the charging will take. Minimum an hour. I'm at six percent now, but now it's downhill. Nine kilometers to go. Woo we did it. Ooh, thirty something Swedish. <laughs> I'm guessing Swedish Kronen. Thank you very much, Jürgen. So nice of you. The Hyundai Ionic driver. Um, and I will stop the stream, I think, when I start charging. And then I will restart a new stream. <laughs> oh my god, Rich Jorgen, that's true. I will start a new stream then with 130 kilometers an hour test. So shortly before I start driving. And then tomorrow I start the, the live stream with the heat pump right before we start driving so i'm guessing 10 30. yeah i just wanted to say i have a power limit of around 40. <laughs> oh god you guys are funny seven kilometers not using any energy as far as i can see uh, right now the power meter is in the middle. I'm just rolling. Is Jürgen from Bergen? Maybe Chris could get a mailing address and we could send him things to wear when driving. <laughs> and costumes, stuff like this. Oh man, I have 10 kilometers of margin right now. My average consumption is going down, that's nice. Right now when I'm rolling, it says 2 to 3 kilowatt hours per 100 kilometer. Ooh, now I have to use power. Ooh, 5 kilometers to go, just a tiny. I would love to see Chris in a the Panda 1Z. <laughs> at the charger plugging in an EV. <laughs> Four kilometers to go, almost there. So the only people donating tonight were people that are already patrons of mine. <laughs> thank you, Jürgen, and thank you, Darren. It's very nice of you. It, it says it's 850 euros that pays for the, for the data of today. Almost for the data for tomorrow too, it's six euros. Creepy guy in one C. <laughs> I would buy a Chris in a connection. No, you can't do that. I always get the crappy one then. Three and a half kilometers. Consumption is 185. How much? Did Darren paid five euros fifty, so uh, uh, five pounds. I drive a Kona 64 super range. That it's true. Kona rules when it comes to range and region. And uh, efficiency. Damn rich, Darren. Yeah. Darren is rich. I'm at 5%. Now, I will. That would be interesting. We have three and a half degrees. I wasn't driving fast. I wasn't pulling a lot of energy. It will be interesting what charging speed we get at Ionity now. Consumption is 184. I want to get it to 183 again. Did, which was the was it most likely on the way back? Uh, was it most of the time? I would love to have that back. What will you do with Darren's five years? I already said it pays for the data of today. I'm happy now, so I don't have to say anything anymore. I got my money back. <laughs> Screw you all. <laughs> That's so horrible. Oh god, I lived here on the right, I lived here once. For two years, it was a great apartment, but you could hear the people upstairs so loud. It, we couldn't live anymore there, it was so loud.
Yeah, the power distribution of the corner is bad when it comes to getting the power down. That's true. The CCS plug in the front is amazing. Only 73 kilowatt, yes. And Colgate, yes. It, it, it's, it's still okay. Um, performance is rigged. Ooh, we have turtle mode. Look at that. I have turtle mode. It's going to be turtle mode at 5% and 16 kilometers of range. Chris turns into Bjorn. How? Do I need the baggy pants? <laughs> Again, British, British uh, uh, Audi. So many British people here. So let's hope I only two works. That would be nice. I see green. Green is good. I take the one furthest away, as always. Beep, beep. Nobody needs to. Okay, let's charge a bit. Uh, first, I have to film this, eh? Oh, come on. Eh. Yes. To film this, to climb it down. Fan is so loud. Cruise control off. One kilowatt for heat. There we go. And here we are, our average consumption, 183, right now the heat takes one, whoever it is. We drove 282 kilometers, I have 16 kilometers range left, but we'll, uh, I have to look at the trip meter. Trip meter says 282.3, I will put in here what Google Maps says about that, if this is correct, because on my... Winter, ra winter tire range t uh, uh, consumption test, it was spot on. Our average speed is good, uh, and yeah, our time, we arrived with 5%, I will now charge, we'll see if it, we get 100 kilowatt. Good, turn this off. <laughs> Who donated? Was it Jill? No! Richard, oh god, I can't see. Richard McFarlane can. Thank you very much. 4.99 pounds. That's nice. Stop it, people. Chris has enough already to pay for today. That's true. Screw him. I will plug in. Let's charge. Heard the click. Let's see the charging speed we get.
I'm back. Oh, my back hurts. Is he there too? <laughs> I'm creepy guy. So uh, I started with 77 kilowatt at 5%, but it, it's rising. It's already at 80. So speed is going up. Charging speed. I am um, was like last time. I think it will go up to 100 kilowatt in the next few minutes. My wife wrote me a message. Where's my baby? Oh my god, easy as for the win. <laughs> have you been in Hol to Holstadt? No, I have not. I've never been to Holstadt. Ooh, it's warm in here. Turn down the heat. It says one and a half hours. Now it's time to eat something. I'm hungry. Ooh, now I'm already at, uh, already at 20%. Now I'm 13. What are you saying? Hmm? Yes, I type messages very slowly. I'm sorry. I'm old. Da, 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 da. I know. I'm not on the hype of social media, says the guy with the. Uh, Almost 10,000 subscribers on his YouTube channel. I'm very proud of that. Very proud of that. What is this? Oh, yeah. I will look at the charging speed and then I will eat. And then see if I have time for the drone, but I doubt it. I really doubt it. An hour and a half time for hot dog and buns. It now says one an hour and 20 minutes. Faster and faster. Let's look. It's nine kilometers per minute charging. Salt from the food before, yeah, eat salt uh, for breakfast. 90 kilowatt right now. It's working. Oh, in 15 minutes. <laughs> yeah, I love when charging works. Yeah. I was gone for a while. I had to, to bake cookies for my boys. Cute. What was your range? We arrived with 282 kilometers and I had 16 kilometers left or 5%. I calculate at home. What's 5% from 282 kilometers? Let's do it now. Uh, 82 plus 5% is 296. We'll have to see how we do that. Oh, 
Junge. Someone sent me 20 euros on, on PayPal to email back. Who is that? <laughs> He's sending a message because we're doing the heat pump test tomorrow. That's nice. Oh, what was the name? I should remember that. Mr. Klaus. I don't want to say his whole full name. Maybe he doesn't like that. Thank you, Klaus. Very nice for the donation. I will eat now. This and vegan uh, uh, slices. Something. Whatever. Ooh, there's someone singing. I have no idea. It's way too hot. Should take, turn the climate off. What are we charging at? Still nine kilometers per minute. Maybe that's still a little low, but that was expected. Yeah, I, I, I was expecting 292 with the consumption I had last week with the winter tires at 90. Um, but today when we started, it looked like it would be above 300, but it wasn't. It was not. Let's look at the speed again. Now sitting in your car and eating seems to be the future. <laughs> 92 kilowatt! And we are already at 26%, so we will not reach the 100 kilowatt. Mm. An hour to go, it says now. Is this the shuffle guy? I don't know, he went by. You can't see him anymore. I think that was the shuffle guy. Eighty people here, gonna call you. Toy Boat Chris. <laughs> there it is. The shuffle guy. It's not Straubing, it's Passau. It's where I live. It's the Corona hotspot. Now let's stay in the car. Hmm? 57, 300? Mm -hmm. I don't know what you mean. was 18.3 time 3 is 3 is let's calculate what the battery gave us 183 times 296 54 kilowatt hours 0.2 Well, that's all the energy I got out of the car. Ooh, phone is warm, it's darkened. Mm. Since big batteries need long times to charge, so you have to have fast how much? Too much fast charging bad for the battery. Yes, it is. Slow charging is better. We almost always have to think of heat loss while driving. You never get out of the battery exactly what battery you're having. And you have no idea how accurate the uh, consumption... Sorry, YouTube, YouTube kicked me out. So you never know if this, the consumption meter in here is correct, 183. 
then and then this was the trip true so i have to at home i'd have to do google maps from the charger back there to erding and back here is that 282 kilometers maybe it's more maybe it's less so it's 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 you never reach the perfect number when test testing stuff like that yeah i wanted to turn off the the, the live stream and now i don't huh <laughs> 37 percent already mm. I guess I will not fly my drone, huh? <laughs> you don't need to see me eating, huh? annoying and disgusting Good stuff drinking. May have to go to pee. I mean, I've been in a car for three hours. More. Mm -hmm. What I'm eating is all dry, so I can't make the seeds dirty. Only salt. <laughs> I won't be sleeping in the car, that's not my thing. <laughs> Mark is here! What time is it there? 6.43. Just got up? No, we're well, a farm, we have to get up earlier. Certainly cold when you open the door. Yuck. Not nice. But 44%. But charging to 50% and I have 137 kilometers. I could already go to the next ionity church. Well, I could go there. It's 70 kilometers. How are you, Mark? Yeah, I woke about an hour ago. <laughs> Seven degrees here at the moment, sun has not risen yet. 8.5 right now in the sun. Without the sun it would be four and a half or so. Ooh, battery cooling is on.
So I guess I don't stop the live stream, huh? <laughs> I guess not. So I charge 200% again, then I really stop the live stream, restart a new stream with 130. Schmitza, Schmitza Pizza! No, yeah, it's nice weather, but cold. <laughs> it's cute how important it is to everyone. <laughs> Metal. I wouldn't call it metal. How's that? We had fifty percent. How long was that? How long are we dry? Uh, where we, are we here? Twenty minutes? Well, I could look at the charger. Eh? I gotta look. Clean the car. It's always the same. Salt. You have a creepy shovel man on the side here. <laughs> you really do. You can't see. There's a guy just standing there who walked by before. Now he's just standing there looking around. Not in my direction. He's a creepy guy. Ah, good morning all. It's true. It's a really good uh, thing how to well, what happens if someone breaks into the car? <laughs> you you scream and nothing happens. But I have it on on live stream video. If if he shows or he or she shows his face or her face. We are at fifty four percent, almost fifty five. That means fifty percent charge, and I just looked in twenty minutes. That's okay. First 50% in 20 minutes, and it says still 50 minutes to 100%. In the summer, the whole charging, se charging session from 3% to 100 was 62 or 63 minutes. Unplug the action camera. No. No, come. Let's see, is it full? Hundred percent, nice. Yeah, this is full. Yeah, what is this country? Alien just arrived. I have to clean out here where the cables are. It's all salt. Should I do the drone flying? I don't know. I mean, I have time. It says 50 minutes. I should try it somewhere. It'd be interesting. First, I want to take a few pictures. You can see creepy shovel man in front. Yeah. 
you know, take a few pictures of the car and me. Yeah, it's this guy. Can you see him? Here on the right? He's just walking by and looking. Like he has no, doesn't know what to do. Look, he doesn't know what to do. Please take care of the car. Please. <laughs> Back. Did you make fun of me? Of course you did. Ooh, now 35 minutes. How did that change so fast? The camera. <laughs> 35 minutes now. That went down fast. Um, I'll make the intro video for the next video now with 130 kilometers an hour. Outside. Uh, I need camera. Hello, hello, not working, not because. Camera, microphone is not on. Hello, yes, it works. I'll make the short introduction video. You'll see the creepy guy, so me, outside too. That was it. You were live. You saw live a video that will come uh, uh, in, I don't know, this week. I want to bring the the heat pump video, I think, first. The one tomorrow. I really would love to bring the video live tomorrow morning. Uh, so tomorrow evening. That would be amazing. Look at the creepy guy. That's me.
You guys already know who I am. I'm Mr. Mr. Creep. What? You're not going up. I never get this. Huh. Man and white <laughs> coats will come. 30 minutes. Should I test the drone? It says it's 30 minutes. But I won't take you with me. Oh, should I? Maybe I take you guys with me. And then we try the, the drone. <laughs> Would you want that? He pump video is tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow I, I'll do a comparison. Someone from Erfurt is so nice coming here. And we'll meet up. He has a Max with the exact same winter tires that I have. And then we're gonna drive two hours and then we'll see what his heat is using energy and what my heat is using. That I think is pretty interesting. But the music is sleepy, eh? Turn it off. <laughs> so do we do the drone? What do you say? Yep, drone, please. Teddy, take us with you. It's not cold really today. It, it, it was cold in the morning. I had minus two mi in the car, minus four degrees even. But right now, can you look at my beautiful shirt when I'm having it buttoned up all the way? Look, there's a little zipper here. And they put stuff in there, I wouldn't know what. <laughs> Charging card. Um, I need my jacket, it's not that warm. Daddy brings his jacket. And then I will fly. But I need, no, I can't. I can't bring you because I need the phone to fly. <laughs> so, no, I have the app on the phone and so it just doesn't work. Yeah, so, yeah, let's do it like this. I stopped the stream now, <coughs> I fly with the drone a bit, test it, um, um, and then in half an hour this is 100%, or maybe at 95% I drive to the other charger on the other side and then uh, I restart the stream in a new with a new name. Is that okay with you? Well. well you can't do anything about it anyways if I do it. Okay, thank you much for watching. Have a great day and take care. Um, see you in, I guess, 30 to 40 minutes. Okay. Bye.